hold my hand. It's going to be fine. Uh, look, thanks, everybody. Thanks, CBS. Thanks, David Letterman and Worldwide Pants. But uh, I quit. We're out of here. <laughs> it's been great. Uh, but... <laughs> Evangeline has to go. Can you, can, you, uh, can you tell Adam I'll be right there? Oh, I'll, I'll let him know. All right, thanks a lot. Bye. Right, bye. Evangeline Lilly, everybody. So, thank you so much. Bye. I hate you so much right now. <laughs> My next guest is a very talented actor. Uh, <laughs> he's a lovely man, he's a friend of the show, the adorable Adam Goldberg, everybody, Adam Goldberg. How are you, pal? I'm all right. I just feel like I'm gonna be a real downer. Oh after no, that. no, no! You mustn't. It's all play acting. Look, it's wait, all. Just look at me. You're gorgeous. And then look at her. <laughs> and then look at me. Oh. And then look at her. And then put the two of us. Ooh, wait a minute. Wait, no, that. that's good. I'm European. That works for me. I mean, she's... <laughs> but she's got the, the the pink thing, and she's in a good mood. She's happy about the house burning you know... down. <laughs> If you can find a woman that's happy about her house burning down, that you you hang on to that one, well, she, son. She's she's stoked about her allergies. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's fantastic. She's, a, she's an adorable girl, isn't she? Yeah. You Have know you that, met her before? No, I just met her back there. I'm sure there's got to be trouble, deep seated trouble. Oh, I'm sure it. of it. I'm yeah. sure of it. Yeah. It's got to be a cover up, right? It's got to be. But I'd like to be the guy to find it. Wow, you like, yeah. to, like to uncover it. Do you like do you like crazy women? Is that what you're saying? Yeah, that, yeah, you do? yeah. Well, I don't know if I like them, but they're around a lot. They're, they're, you know, <laughs> I have no idea what you mean. Well, they, they end up, you know, in my proximity somehow. I, you, I, 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 I draw, you know, I, I, I attract them. Do you think you attract crazy women or you make them crazy with your failure to commit? Well, well. I, no, I gotta say, no, it's I a union thing. I de <laughs> no, I, no, I definitely make them crazier. For sure, really? yeah. But no, they, they, they start out that way. Are you, are you in a relationship right now? Uh, you know, I don't, I don't really discuss my personal life, but... Um, no, then! I, I will tell you, though, about my plans for, for, for Valentine's Day. What, though, what are you if, doing? If you're then? interested. I, was, I wasn't going to talk about this, but I figured it's Valentine's Day, and, you know, I'm, I'm trying to be a little bit more open. My therapist says it's a, right, a it's good idea. So, um, I'm going to go... You know that place, Rough Trade, over in Silver Lake? <laughs> I've, I've heard of it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. It's, it's like a hipster sort of bondage shop, you know, but it's like for Silver Lake hipsters, so it's sort of like, you know. It's, it's ironic. It's ironic. Yeah, ironic, like, yeah, yeah. So usually, and I do this every Thursday anyway, so it just so happens that, uh, you know, Valentine's Day falls on a Thursday. So right. So it turns out these are my Valentine's Day plans. So I go over there, and then I uh, draw myself a warm bath um, after some yoga. I do yoga in front of the big screen. Right. Um, and then uh, I cut some petals from the garden, dim the lights, and then I just have an evening. Uh, Just you on your own? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> it's, it's, I miss Evangeline. Do you miss Evangeline? <laughs> yeah, I, know, I, know. <laughs> I, to I told you the thing. No, no, no. No, no, no. Are you a romantic? I'm working, you... Now I'm working blue. No, you know? no, no, you're not working blue. Yeah. What are you working on right now? What have you been doing? Yeah, you know, that's the thing about this whole writer strike thing is that for the last three months I could say, like, you know, so, you know what are you working on? And it Here gets to be this kind of... It's a sort of annoying question. I don't mean from you. you no, know, no, it's but, annoying. I get but it. But in general, you know, you go out. What are you, what are you doing? What are you working on? What are you working on? And you know, a lot of times, uh, you know, actors aren't aren't working. You know, no, I, um, I remember. Yeah. And uh, but for three months, you could just go. You know, writer strike. Strike. Yeah. <laughs> what you gonna do? Yeah. You know, you know, yeah. Yeah. Solidarity, though. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah exactly. Exactly. Yeah, yeah. Oh, I'm picketing. You know. Yeah. Yeah. Um, <laughs> and so now it's over, and I'm strangely very depressed, you know, because now I can't use that as a, an excuse for not for not working. Yeah. I have. So what am I working on? Uh, well, I was working up until the writer's well, strike. Well, that's, right. that's, yeah, that's pretty I did, good. Yeah, I, did, yeah, yeah, I, did a, yeah. I did a couple of movies, but since the writer's strike, I guess it's been, what, like 36 hours or yeah, something yeah, like that? Yeah, it's all right. You don't have to go straight. Don't go rushing into yeah, work. Are you still sick? I mean, I don't want to... Yeah, reasonably. Yeah, I think I'm, I'm past contagious, though. Yeah. I'm not... They what, say what, I'm what are you, four days? What? What are you, four days? Yeah, yeah, four or five days. Um, I think just keep it handy. That's yeah, for you. Yeah, that was, yeah, yeah. That's my Valentine's gift, too. Exactly. The thing of it is... The thing of it is, is that... Uh, I just have to turn it this way so that you can't tell what type it is. Yeah, right, right. Because exactly. I don't know if, they're, if they advertise on CBS. And if they don't, frankly, they're damn fools. No, it's... it's... <laughs>
No, I think, you know, then you get another sponsor, though, don't you? Yeah, well, get them to sponsor me? Yeah, don't you think? I don't think I, I, I'm really the face of See, sanity. See, I, 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 <laughs> I, I actually... Sanitize us. I, I brought, yeah, sanity. I, I actually brought it up because I want them to sponsor me. I was hoping that I would get a lifetime supply of... Some people come out in their Dolce & Gabbana. I right. come out with my, uh... Well, you guys know what it is. It's not the generic. It's not... It's Priel. We'll call it that. Yeah, well, let, let's say it's Priel. Let's say that. Um, but no, I got... I was sick, like, all of December. I, I can't get sick again. But were you, 72 why, why, why were you, what were you, what were you sick with? Flu? Well, everybody's got this, you know. I just everywhere, isn't it's it? No, it's ridiculous. You can't go anywhere. I know, I know. Uh, I'm so covered no, I got, I got, and then your guests, you know, and then I they know. keep getting you probably well, stuck Well, people around. keep coming out here all yeah. the time with she, their... Uh, she's probably never sick. I don't care what she's yeah, got. Yeah, I know, right? Yeah. 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 If that girl comes out here with leprosy, I'm I all know. over her like a cheap suit. I don't care. Yeah. Yeah. I don't think this the would work, though. The clap for leprosy? <laughs> no, no, this is, it's everything. It's pure alcohol. It'll kill anything. Damn near killed me, actually. Yeah. <laughs> but, uh... Oh, wait, oh, sorry. I, we've talked too long. Yeah. No, whatever. Let's yeah. talk more about bronchitis and sinusitis. No. Uh, on, on the heels of Evangeline Lilly just being... <laughs> no. Just pink and No, we have to go. Gorgeous. Adam Goldberg, everybody. We'll be right back. Uh, look, I just wanted to say uh, thank you, CBS, thank you, David Letterman, thank you, Worldwide Pants, but uh, <laughs> things didn't work out with Evangeline and me, but uh, Adam and I, it's kind of like, you know, fingers crossed. Uh, um, so, so long. Uh, but before we go, uh, here, uh, uh, performing the title track uh, from our Grammy-nominated album, Memento, she's playing our song. Please welcome Babel Gilberto. Look, look. I'm going to go and see this movie. <laughs> Please welcome Adam Goldberg, everybody. Adam Goldberg. Oh, yeah, no, yeah. crazy. That's crazy. amazing. I just went like that, and then I got. Oh, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> All right, hold on one second. <laughs> you okay. get your five bucks. All right. <laughs> so now I get the appeal. Oh yeah, that's why you do what you do? Yeah, you no, just, it's you just a five bucks. And then you get yeah. a five bucks. No, 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 for, of your job. I get the appeal of oh, your job. Oh, it's a great job to it's have a, yeah, this. Incredible Ooh. control. Although I, I don't see enough girls that can do that with their pants. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's why I work that's in the, the most movies. That's the awesome thing I've ever seen in a movie, except yeah. for maybe some other things. But that yeah. was really cool. Not bad, right? That's really, really cool. I, I'm afraid that might be the extent of the of the sexiness in the movie, since I play a brooding avant-garde uh, music composer, and oh, she I plays a, a gallerist. So uh, that's it. That little that, that that thigh flesh. There's, actually, there's some hot vegetables in it, though. <laughs> well, we won't be showing that clip here. <laughs> I know, that's funny. You, you can show sort of the pelvic area of a, of a, of a blonde woman, but you can't show, uh, what, a funny cucumber? <laughs> like, what, can you describe the Am I even allowed to it describe the It was an vegetables? apple that looked like an excited man. <laughs> How awesome is you know, that? You know what? How awesome is that? That's, you know, I've, I've uh, been referred to as such. Um, yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> that what was that, a tomato that you did show, though? That was a tomato, That yeah. tomato was kind of... It's yeah, kinda, it was graphic. Do you, do you yeah. have... It was kind of hot. Yeah, yeah. Do I'm you, sorry, it, it's a photograph. Do, it's, oh, you don't have that on you? Not anymore. I thought... I was hoping maybe for, in the gift bag or something. Just I don't know, listen. Gift bag? Uh, What's your... Actually, this is not the Tonight Show, yeah, I know, buddy. I know, I'm sorry. <laughs> you're just lucky the roof isn't leaking. Yeah, I know. I know. No, you're right. Yeah, yeah. So you been? I, nice I've, been, I've been good. Uh, yeah. I've been fine. I've been I, all right. Yeah. Right. Yeah. How you're, you been? I'm, I'm okay. I'm okay. Yeah. Mustn't, mustn't grumble. Yeah. You know, I've, I've been all right. You don't I, want to do it on, in front of everybody. Then it looks like you're, you know. You know, like ungrateful? Uh, yeah, ungrateful. You know, bourgeois complaining. No one wants to hear about That's that. That's what I think. Yeah, yes. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> but as long as we're on the subject. Uh, yes. Let's see, what could I gripe about? So my, uh, all, well, you're, you're, all three of my emails were hacked uh, yesterday, two you're days ago. You're kidding me, really? Someone yeah, hacked into your email? Yeah, yeah, all three. It was, it was really amazing. What do you mean all three? One, all, all three what, what, well, I have three different email accounts, you know, the, and I like to divert kind of, them. What kind of Hollywood <laughs> bulala is this? It's yeah. not... Three, three email accounts? It's not, it's not for any... Nobody cares about me. It's not about, like, protecting my identity or anything. It's because I order a lot of very odd, you know, things that come in brown paper bags, and you want to... <laughs> 
you know, you want to make sure that you're diverting all of the mail so that, you know, your, you your, post office your girlfriend or your mother, you know, or whomever, you know. Psychiatrist. Or your, your shrink or whatever. Yeah. Are you still doing that? You still go to therapy? Do you therapy? Um, I haven't been to therapy in, I think it's been about a year and a half. So okay. I've been about a year and a half sober. Yeah. yeah. Um, <laughs> What do you, you want to get back? Yeah, no, yeah. I think it's I, I, I think it's time before I start uh, yeah fooling around with tomatoes. But um, what about you? Are you, you, know you I've got, got a new tattoo. I know you have some tattoos. Oh my! So look, look at that. Like that? That's like a military tattoo. Yeah, yeah, isn't it? Uh, yeah it goes all the way up, man. It Are you kidding? All me? the way up and round and, and ends up at my. Well, I don't understand. Did you get that on shore leave? I don't. Yeah, understand. yeah, yeah. That's look, at that. look, at look, that. look at that. Look at that. Look at that. That's nice. Yeah. Look, look at, at the detail. Yeah, I know. That is really nice. Yeah, and see that bit there. That's where it really hurts. Yeah, yeah, right. Yeah. You know, the worst oh, one I ever got was when it goes over the clavicle. Is that you, a clavicle? You, you, Are you allowed to say clavicle? a musical instrument, isn't it? <laughs> I think that's a clave. No, no, or a clavinet, you're thinking. Uh, no, that's a clarinet. clarinet. No, 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 clavinet's the... No, is, is clavinet's that, and then that's a the accordion. Keyboard. And then and, there's a clarinet, uh, the which is, is a clarinet. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And this is the clavinet, and that's the pancreas. Yeah, yeah. yeah you, but you have one there? I have, I have one I'm not, I'm not you're, thrilled you're about. It was one, because most of the ones I got, I got because there's a guy, there's an artist named Mark Mahoney in, in Los Angeles who's like an incredible, detailed, you know, gray and black, does, you know, stuff like that. Um, but every, you know, in the, in the old days, I'd be like, oh, I'm in New Orleans, you know, I'll get yeah, a tattoo, yeah. you know, or whatever. You know, I'm in Tucson, I'll get a tattoo, you know. Where, where'd, you get, where'd you get that one, then? New Orleans. I don't yeah. actually feel... <laughs> Too bad about making fun of it because they actually posted some really uh, well. Let's see it. Then. Some, can, can we some see bad it? photos you, online. Uh, no, it's not bad. It was a, it was a it was a reproduction oh, of an old of an old tattoo. Yeah, that's, that's you know like of one. From, it was like literally from like the turn of the century, which is a great idea if you're living uh, you know at the, the turn, turn of, of the, the century. century. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> but uh, but that right over here. That, that must have been very really painful. painful. Yeah, 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 yeah. Also the one on my. Oy vey. This was. <laughs> You can't say that, don't you? You can't say it. No? Can't do it? Is any of this gonna... Oh, yeah. It's gonna it be a lot, get, of, they'll lot just, of Tim they'll, Robbins they'll tonight, just have huh? to, They'll just have to guess what you said. You, you said, the one on my, and then it'll drop right, right. out, and then it'll come back, and then we'll, where did he get it? And but you'll that's have when to, you, do the, you do the funny... What is that thing that you do? Well, the... the, the, the ooh la la. Ooh la la. Yeah, yeah I like that. But that's only when I say a bad word. What happens when I do it? Well, we'll have to think of something. Oy vey. Oy vey. Can we do an oy vey? Well, you'll, you'll have to record a quick oy vey so we can put it do on. Do an oy vey? Oh, yeah, ready? Uh, uh, quiet, please. <coughs> quiet line. Oy vey. I think it'll have to be faster. Does it have to be faster? Oy vey. Oy vey. <laughs> it's amazing. Yeah, yeah, we have it. Yeah, it's good, yeah, yeah. yeah. I spend, uh... Thank you. Thank you. Spend 15 years trying not to get typecast, and I just... <laughs> <laughs> Oh, come on. No, it's, fine. it's just a bit of fun. No, I know. It's just no. a bit of fun. No, it's fine. Nobody it's fine. cares. Hey, listen, I'm having a great time. Claire. I'm worried about no, you. No, no, no. Everything's good. Every, Did every... you give up smoking yet? Uh, since I saw you out in the smoking section? Yeah. Uh, <laughs> no, Craig, Craig, by the way, I want to be clear. I want to be clear. Craig was not smoking cigarettes. Yeah. Um, and... Uh, <laughs> <laughs> a lot of that. I, I don't know what that is. I don't know. It's like, like a huge bong <laughs> and like a big bowl. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just like, no, that was just me playing my clavicle. Oh, is that what I was yeah. playing? Yeah. Uh, yeah, I really, it's really, yeah, not a good idea. I did buy that book. Have you, have you heard about, you, you know this book, the Alan Carr book? What? There's some book that apparently everybody reads. It's this guy, Alan Carr. And he, and, the and Bible? He, it's, that's what it is, yeah. This guy, Alan Carr, wrote the Bible. Uh, <laughs> it's a little known fact. No, but it's apparently like the anti you know, the non-smoking Bible. Well, you read this, you read this book and apparently you stop Apparently you read it and you stop. And it's not like apparently a bunch of graphic pictures. You're supposed to smoke and apparently he brainwashes you while you're reading it. And by the end, you don't know why you're not smoking anymore. You're just not. Oh, now, this sounds like snake oil No, it sounds crazy. No, 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 no. Believe me. Listen, I'm, I'm extremely skeptical, but not so skeptical that... Uh, I've, I've actually opened it and read it. In other words, I'm afraid of opening it. You're it, afraid it'll work. I'm afraid it'll work. Which means yeah. you have to go back to therapy. Right. Because right. that's... <laughs> because the problem is not smoking the cigarettes, although ultimately that will be the problem. The problem is that you're not prepared to accept the success of stopping smoking. <laughs> uh, because... Because... And I am the new Dr. Phil, by the way. Yeah. Because... <laughs> Because you've got, you still haven't learned to love yourself properly. Oh. 
Uh, do you think also maybe I'll stop having dreams with my father's head and my mother's body? <laughs> that Dude, one was funny because yeah, it was like yeah, a laugh, yeah, but then, like, like, it was like a yeah, laugh, yeah, but a, they were like, what, what? Really uncomfortable. <laughs> They're like, wait, wait, no, he really is crazy. Look, no, there, he really is crazy. <laughs> There's a little something that we all have, you know, between the ages of seven and nine called the Oedipal Complex. Yeah, some of us right. didn't have Right, well, I mean, a lot, uh, those are Americans, a lot of Americans. <laughs> and, and, I mean, I should say those of us born here, you know. Yeah. And, uh, anyway, I'm still in, I'm still, you know, sort of uh, in, in the midst of my Oedipal Complex. And, you know, you, so you, seven to nine, seven to thirty-nine, you know. <laughs> You want to get a tattoo for that? We're out of time, though. Really, really that's it? Because I was really gonna, I was gonna just make it get, get even more vulgar. <laughs> I was gonna, so we'd have to do like an Oiga Vault, you know, and even longer. You have to say it quicker. Uh, Oiga Vault. All right. All right. <laughs> Thanks a lot. Adam Goldberg, everybody. Right, 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 right. My, uh, my first guest tonight is an actor, he's a musician, he's a good friend of the show. Please welcome the lovely and fragrant Adam Goldberg, everybody. Adam Goldberg. I'm all right. Really? What's wrong? No, I'm all right. I'm, uh, I, I, I mean, I should be honest, right? Yeah, why? All right. Yeah, yeah, okay. What? Are you looking at my breast? I'm not. <laughs> I'm not looking at your, uh, at your, uh, at your, uh, breasts. No. Right. Um, I'm, uh, well, you know, I, I, I quit smoking. Oh, dear. So I'm a little cranky. I mean, yes. Yeah. I mean, that's good that you quit smoking. I know. Um, but, you know, the last time I was here, we, we passed each other as I was going to. Uh, yeah, you were going to smoke, and I said, yeah. hey, where are you going? Right, right. Mm -hmm. And I said, I'm going to go, I'm going to go smoke. And, uh, you know, that's what I do before these shows, because it's a little anxiety inducing to you me. You should be nervous about this show. This is crap. Well, <laughs> sorry, sorry, sorry. I know. No, Basura. I, I know. Basura. I, I, I do. Tr I know. I do. I guess, and 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 uh, yeah. The truth of it is, on the way here, I do have to tell myself that it's yeah, a sort yeah, of no, that's I, right, I, go, I understand. I go, the, the, the show is meaningless. Nobody watches Craig. Exactly. You know? Exactly. Um, and um, but uh, yeah, no. It's you know, it's a little anxiety-inducing. So so it's it's strange because I was just sitting there, and now I'm playing like iPhone tennis for like 45 minutes back there. Um, and what I'm like, I'm 12 years old. You know well, what no, I mean? No, I haven't no, played. No, no, I literally no. haven't played a video game since I was like you know, like since I was 18. Really? And now. It's just like, you know. So I, have, so I have carpal tunnel and I'm cranky. But other than that, I'm well. How have you been? Yeah, I'm all right. I'm concerned yeah. that you're good. You haven't put on any, any weight, though. That's good. That, I think, is due to the irritable bowel syndrome I've had since I was <laughs> Um So it sort of all balances out. I know I was a little concerned about that, too. But uh, regular as a, as a whistle. Everything is just uh, yeah. zipping along there? Yeah, just zipping along quite... <laughs> How is the uh, situation? Are the situation all right? <laughs> the, the uh, I, I actually I, I refer to mine as the as the bloat. The bloat. Um, yeah, um, it's uh, it's good. The situation room is fine. It's uh, not um, the situation room. The situation room is with Wolf Blitzer. Wolf, Wolf Blitzer. Yeah, no. But some, I like Wolf Blitzer, but I suspect he doesn't have good abs. But <laughs> sometimes. Now Anderson Cooper, you well, know yeah. he's got abs. Yeah, you know, yeah. Well, because and you know every time you see the you know the sort of ads for CNN, he's always in. The, he's got like the T-shirt like yeah, up yeah. here. Yeah, yeah. Like he's Larry a, the Cable Guy. He's holding the yeah, microphone yeah. and he's you know, <laughs> right. Yeah. Um, but I mean, God bless him. You know, Anderson. Uh, but uh, I've, I've oftentimes have a case of the wolf blitzer. You're touching, well. you're touching me. <laughs> have you been to some kind of life coach or something like that? <laughs> I, uh, well, what's I, the deal I, with touch I, me? I right? don't know what to do with my hands. Yeah, well, all right, all right. Well, let's be honest. When, when you, you, when you were because out the, here before, no, no, no. Life, you wouldn't, I wouldn't let you smoke a cigarette. That's not true. I mean, look, let's come on. Like, you got to be honest with the people. I always kept a cigarette you kept down a cigarette here, down you know, there, and you guys yeah. digitally removed the smoke later. Digitally um, removed. <laughs> Did you know? We don't even have a computer here. I, a couple of times, I, I think you, a couple of times, I think you digitally removed my appearance entirely. No, that's called get bumped. That's oh, nothing right, that's to do with. That's, with, that's yeah. nothing. No, no. But I like. Did you? So have you been to some kind of Tony Robbins um, thing or something? I, 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 I was. I was told that you know. I. I I've you know, been, I really I, value you. I've been. Uh, <laughs> I've been. Um, I started going to a. The strange thing 
is, I now want a cigarette. Yeah. <laughs> That's, imagine being me. I'm around me all the time. Yeah, you, you know, I mean? you, you, But you quit a lot of things, right? I did, yeah. Did you, smoking you, was, was the hardest thing to quit. It was, right? It was, absolutely. Yeah, well, you stop drinking. Right? I stopped drinking. You know, you lose 20 pounds. People are like, oh, look at right, you. Right. You look great. Not living in a dumpster. But, the, uh, <laughs> but when you stop smoking, it's, it's very difficult. You're cranky and you're upset. Well, all you, your associations are all, you know, you make a telephone call, you know, you're driving, you're stuck in traffic. Maybe you, you know, should get a new addiction. It, Maybe uh, um, I've been looking into internet porn as a possible uh, <laughs> sort of supplement. Um, but that's very difficult to do in a restaurant after a meal. You know, they, uh, <laughs> they should make everybody go outside like they do with cigarettes. <laughs> <laughs> go, that looks uh, like a good restaurant. Look at all these people outside. <laughs> I, I don't know that it's, it's, strictly speaking, I don't know that it's banned. I mean, you can't be nude, but you could probably, I mean, I think you're allowed to... Really? Do you think you could give yourself a bit of I a think hand shandy? You're, you're probably you're, allowed to just... I think you can do whatever you want as long as you don't take your clothes off. I mean, I don't know. I have no idea. I don't know if that's true or else you're the prisons not, would be empty. That, <laughs> I don't... <laughs> I'm sorry but, for robbing the bank, but I was wearing my clothes. Well, case to spare. Yeah, no, 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 I don't mean you can do, I don't think you can murder somebody in, as long as you're wearing clothes. But I think that, like, you're probably, I don't know, can you touch yourself? I know you can't rub up against people in the subway. Believe me, I know All this. right, yeah. yeah. Um, <laughs> but I don't know that you're not allowed to rub up against yourself. Uh, it'd be, it'd be and, worth finding out, because I might, I might rub up against myself I later. think it's something, like, yeah. the problem is, when you're done, you want a cigarette, so. Not me, I haven't had a cigarette in years. Right, but I'm But saying, then again, I haven't rubbed up against myself in years. Really? Have you not? No, I don't do that anymore. <laughs> Thanks to the power of positive thinking. Wow. <laughs> really? Years? Hours. <laughs> I don't know. Yeah, I think it's, but you're a Catholic or something, right? No, 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 no. I, and I believe that, uh, you know, many denominations, uh, you know, do, right, enjoy yeah, self-pleasure. Uh, they do, but then, but some, I think, when they indulge, don't they go to hell or something? Or uh, I don't know. I don't know enough about it. I suspect, though, that it's, you know, church, certain churches don't encourage it. Right, right, right. Yeah, you know. it's not, it's, it wouldn't be part of, like, a sermon or... Uh, no, 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 no. I, yeah. I don't think, I don't think so. Yeah. No. Are you, I'm checking, checking to see how much time is left. <laughs> <laughs> I was checking to see with, if he was actually going. Ah! Uh, right, 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 right. Is there a little censor over there? He's not a censor. He's. A, is there he, a little Catholic over there? Yeah, no. <laughs> no, he, there is. No, he's, he's Jewish. He's Jewish. It's, Who are we Michael. looking at? It's oh, yeah. yeah. There's a. Oh, okay. Because I just see I see the monitor and I I just gravitate towards my image. You know, that's all. I, yeah. oh, see, yeah, they have yeah. a monitor down there, did so it's hard not to keep a, looking at how huge your hair is. Look at my that. hair? No, 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 not yours. I'm, I mean, my, one's hair. You don't even look at me in the monitor. You only look at you. <laughs> well, the thing, the weird thing about being on these talk shows is, is that you know you're basically shot just from this. I mean, unless you really, unless you do this, you know, you don't really. This is actually my better side. I mean, I don't have. Oh, no, you, you stay there. I'll talk to you like this. I mean, neither side is. Do great, you? Uh, but you know what's funny? Yeah. This side is better. This side, this side is better for my hair. Yeah. This side is better for my nose. Um, Actually, I was going to talk to you. Yeah, I know. Yeah, I know. Yeah, it's yeah. all right. I'm, I'm going to be working on that next. I, I think I'm. Are you get plastic I'm, surgery? Uh, yeah, absolutely. I'm going to no. do. The, yeah, because I got Because I'm, I'm not smoking. I got to. Re you said replace it with something, so I'm going to go nuts. Get get. I'm going to uh, go get, get boobies. Nuts. Get boobies. Oh, I'm going to get. Tiaras? Tiaras? You're going to get, get tiaras? I'm going to just go nuts, you know. I'm going to get, I'm going to do the nose. I'm going to get plugs, which I don't even need, you know. I'm just going to cover my forehead with plugs. Do, you should try and get, ask them to turn you into a Klingon. <laughs> I will. I think some people end up uh, leaving Beverly Hills. I mean, have you, have you, you've driven through Beverly Hills and seen people driving that don't look like they, that they're that's citizens like they're of human? Earth. Yeah, yeah, I know. It's bad. You get a lot of plastic surgery. You end they're, up looking very strange. I went to a function the other night. Um, a where function, there, a function. A mm -hmm. fun Actually, I went to see this. Uh, see, if I'm too specific and this woman is watching, then she'll feel bad. You right. Know? Well, you don't want to do that. Right. We're not so about making people it was feel a thing, bad. Right. No, not at all. Right. Um, so it was this thing where there was a screening of something and there were some, uh, it was a kind of a generally an older, uh, an older crowd and there was a woman who paid me a very nice compliment which I don't even know I'm talking about this this isn't you know yeah, come on get it out she's very out. no she's very nice but it was really it was like 
Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. No and I, I didn't know if she was um, com at first complimenting me or terrified, you know, yeah. or she was mad at me or... Um, you should I, have done I, that, do that thing that you do, touch right, her. Right. Yeah, you could touch her. My uh, first guest tonight is a very talented actor. He's a good friend of the show. He's got a really lush beard. <laughs> Please welcome Adam Goldberg, everybody. Adam Goldberg. How you doing, Craig? I'm good. I'm it good. was How a lot you? lusher like four days ago. You look very, your beard's very lush. Well, I got a call, you know, I got kind of a last minute call. Friend of the show means somebody canceled, right? Yeah. Right. Uh, <laughs> Actually, no, no, as it turns out, no, I'm just looking over. He's like, no, nobody canceled. We just, uh, we wanted you back. You, really? It's impressive. <laughs> yeah, well, anyway. Sure. No, no, absolutely. That being said, it was a fairly last minute call. Oh, it was last week. And I, right. um, you know, and I've taken a little, I've taken a little time off. Took about eight months. So I had about eight months. Because what happened was I did a, a whirlwind promotion uh, tour for that film. Remember I was here for? Yeah, that uh, film. What was it called again? It was called Untitled. It was a, a film about the uh, art scene in New York. Yeah, it was awesome. It was a huge, it was a, huge. Movie. Yeah, yeah. So we did like a three-hour junket <laughs> for that back in November. And that, you know, it takes a lot because, you yeah, know, you do the hours. interview after the same question, the same for three, three hours, hours in yeah. the same city. You need eight months off yeah, after no, that. So I, so I decided to take a little break and just, just keep growing my beard, but I realized that it wasn't that TV friendly. I mean, it was, I didn't believe it's good it or not. And I like your hair, it's combed forward like the Emperor Caligula. <laughs> That's because I'm actually... Uh, nah, you don't. No, I know, no. it starts, the recession starts around no, here and moves exactly. back. But I do, I have a remarkable guy. Well, you have an incredible team in the makeup department, and they do... A, a fantastic comb over, obvi obviously. Obviously, yeah. yeah. Over this. I'm, this is all combed up from my chest, around the back, and then over the top. <laughs> right. Yeah, no, mine is mine is all back, and then swooping forward. Um, I mean, I was going to have it all epilated or Sally, Han Sally Hansen. Sally Hansen? What the hell are these terms? I know I, nothing of this hairdressing talk. Sally Hansen is like, you know what Nair is, right? Yes, I do. Right. Because you're a swimmer. Uh, yeah, yeah, I right. love. I like to feel like I'm a dolphin in right. the water. I know, so do I. Or in the bath. Or in the, or, or in the bath. Oh, in the bath. Yeah. I like to feel I'm a dolphin in, in the, the bath. bath. Yeah. Yes. You know that's the name of my my autobiography. Dolphin in the bath. It is. It is. Um, and uh, yeah, I had a friend who drunk drunkenly uh, Sally Han. I just like Sally Hansen as a verb. Right. Like I'd never heard of it. But is it the same as Nair? I think it's like Nair. I think they make a series of or she makes a series of products. Right. Uh, Sally does. And uh, and so he apparently sa Sally Hansen his his uh, his entire, entire body. body like you know drunk you know many, many years ago. He's got a second child on on, on his way and I don't want to you know embarrass him. <laughs> Stephen Ur. Stephen Erdman. <coughs> Stephen Erdman. Yeah. Stephen Erdman. Yeah. Let, me, let me write it down. Yeah. So, but, uh, uh, so, and if you yeah. Google him, I'm sure that you'll find some picture of him just as fresh as a, as a, as a baby's I bottom. did shave my entire body once in Winnipeg because I was bored. <laughs> Don't make me leave this podium. <laughs> yeah, you're right there, Jeff. Jeff is terrific. Jeff has a huge metal prod right up his behind. Um, <laughs> ding, ding dong. <laughs> Actually, he yeah. is quick. He's yeah. quick on his pole. He, he is quick on his yeah. pole. Yeah. Hey, so uh, what's the deal then? Uh, you shaved your body and you no, had I, moles. No. Stephen Erdman. Stephen Erdman uh, of New York uh, shaved his shaved his body. No, no you're talking about. Oh, your... oh, right. So I had these moles and then I sh and I and I had to shave because I had to get them removed and biopsied or whatever, and they were pre-cancer. Um, oh, well, this is hilarious. <laughs> They said to me on the, they do pre-interviews, you know, and they say, do you have any funny stories? And I said, I have this hilarious one where I'm really paranoid and hypochondriacal and I found these moles and it turns out that they were atypical and I should get them removed immediately. <laughs> <laughs> so, you bought anyway, a house. Anyway, so I did a little, yeah, so you bought a house. So, you bought a house. Right, right. Um, how's your dating life? I, yeah. um, I had a, well, do you like I realized, peanuts? Do you that? enjoy airline peanuts? That's so bizarre. 
Well, I was just trying to get. No, 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 no. I was just talking to my girlfriend. About, I'm not kidding you about airline peanuts. You have a girlfriend? I know. <laughs> Well, you didn't have a girlfriend the last time you were here. And yes, I, I did. I, mean, I just don't talk. What do you mean? I, I, yes, I do. Well, you, I can't. I, yes, I do. Yes, I do. I did. This is the same girlfriend from eight months ago. Yeah, yeah, but then we were not talking about. It. Look, I was just. No, in, no, uh, no, 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 no. Yeah. Let's get back to this. Don't, don't ask. I don't tell. You know what I mean? Until that's repealed, I'm, my lips are sealed. So you you have a boyfriend? Uh. <laughs> Yeah, I'm gay. Why is that so strange? It's I, not strange. I'm just trying to get yeah, the truth. No, I'm gay. Yeah, I'm gay and I'm straight. I'm both. I'm bi. Really? I'm tri, man. Really? So, yeah. so I feel does like your we girlfriend discussed have it. a beard? What? Uh, <laughs> my girlfriend is the beard. Your girlfriend is, is the, the beard. beard. Yeah. Right. <laughs> See, because... Anyway, so the point, the point is I shaved and I realized that I was in far worse shape than I had always imagined because my hair had created some sort of imaginary six pack. Ah, the way that it yeah. grew, it grew in such a way that I was like, I'm pretty fit. Comb yourself into muscles. That's yeah, right. Yeah, yeah. So when I had to shave this area, I'm like, I'm, I'm like getting that skinny fat guy thing. Oh you know yeah, what I mean? no, I, I've, I used to have that. Now I just have fat, fat right, guy. Right, yeah. fat, fat guy. But that's not, you know, where you're like, and then you get, that's something going on. You know what yeah. they call it, the uh, pupic. A puppet. A little puppet. A little puppet. A little puppet. Yeah. It's a Yiddish word. You puppet. I don't know about that. Well, I'm only, you know. What? I'm only half Jewish. I don't know about that, you know. Um, so, uh, hard to believe. Yeah, that and the girlfriend. Yeah. Adam Goldberg, everybody, will be right back. Because that's not a good sign. How long has so I been there? for yourself. It's a good sign to me. I feel like that's been there the whole time. Yeah, they're just like looming over your shoulder. Yeah, I know, they're like, <laughs> Craig, if, if you need it, Adam no, Goldberg. What I think is great is that they have these little signs they put up on the camera said, Adam Goldberg will be right back. Mm. Like, I don't know after doing this for five and a half years. Right. That, that, <laughs> that what happens after the commercial break is that we come back. Right, of course, of course. Although after a few more, uh -oh. I don't know that you will come back. <laughs> um, hey, you want to keep me coming back, you I, keep I, I, coming. I can up. <laughs> So, do we have a minute to discuss? Because uh, this is a this we get all the time you need. Fascinating. Pal. You so need? his name's Jeff. Jeff Peterson. Jeff Peterson. Yeah, he's a skeleton robot. He's right. a sidekick. That's a great idea. It's my metaphor for deconstructing uh, the the dead art form of the late night talk. Right. Show. No, you're like a you're like a, a Dadaist uh, uh, host. That's right. Yeah. Which I'm sure. <laughs> Most of America is just just <laughs> rolling in their lazy boy right now as I make that <laughs> reference. Um, but uh, yeah, no. When I when I was gonna, it's a great because you wanted to go like super generic with the name, right? Jeff Peterson. Yeah, because yeah, I, I was gonna, I try was gonna do that because I was gonna change Adam Goldberg. You know, many years ago. To actually, what? Uh, to Steve Johnson. <laughs> because I always when I I look in the mirror, I see a Steve Johnson. I know that's not what I know that's not what people. What people see, you know, I've come to appreciate that. People see but, Johnson. Well, I think people <laughs> people might see people might see Johnson. You see your Johnson in the yeah. mirror. People I'm might not see. <laughs> you look at your Johnson in the mirror. You call it Steve. Basically, then, basically, what I'm getting at is, yeah, your girlfriend's I, a dude. I don't I, get any of this. Basically, I have a girlfriend's. I have a girlfriend who's a beard. Yeah. Who shaves me so that when I look in the mirror, I can better see my Johnson. <laughs> Doesn't seem weird to me at all. Not at all. <laughs> Adam Goldberg, everybody, will be we'll right back. We'll be right back. We'll be right back. <laughs> anyway, my next guest is an actor, he's a musician, uh, and a magician. <laughs> he doesn't know about the magician thing yet. <laughs> so, shh, so don't bring it up. <laughs> He doesn't know he's a magician. That's the wonder of magic. <laughs> <laughs> I made myself laugh. Anyway, he's an actor, he's a musician, he's a magician. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know why that makes me laugh. What? Shut up! I think that's funny. <laughs> them on the ropes, Mr. F. <laughs> All right, hang on. Welcome back, everybody. Am I, uh... I'm 
good. I'm good, man. I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. I just didn't. No, no, it's all right. It's all right. I got myself. I don't know what It's amazing how you came out there. It was if you came out by match. Well, it's funny. I heard a little bit of what you're saying. It's funny. Just an interesting coincidence because I brought a little trick. Shut up, really? I did. I did. You see these? Mm -hmm. Right? And then, right? Yeah. Just gone. <laughs> just. I got a, I actually, during the email segment before you come out, um, I was reading up, a, I, I got this email from Kuala Lumpur. What? Is, that, is that a rooster? Yeah, it's an email. It's, well, what happens is, so we know it's a tweet, they put a bird on it. Oh, that is clever. Yeah. That is very clever. <laughs> it's more like a roost, but... <laughs> Well, it's a, it's a it's a bird. It's a yeah. rooster. You know, you don't want to don't put your tainted egg in there because that's not <laughs> whatever comes out of there ain't going back. No, you know I, what I'm I saying? Understand. I understand. I haven't been to tainted eggs in. You, have and, you ever been to? Uh, do you go years to ago? Years ago, I used to go. You know, when I first, you know, kind of came up in, in Hollywood. I mean, I, I was born here, but I like to pretend like I, you know, I got it. when I first got to Hollywood. Uh, from school. Yeah, from yeah. school. Yeah. From, uh, from from finishing school, from charm school. Um, one of the first things I did to just kind of really, because everyone said if you want to make it in this town, you got to go to Tainted Eggs, and. Um, <laughs> And uh, it turns out they were kidding. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it was the opposite and, is and true. Right, yeah. And as it turns out, you know, cut to 20 years later and I didn't You're get on introduced show, yeah, on yeah. your show. Well, I just I have to. No, to, I, I know, was, I know. I was getting to introduce right, you. Right. I started making myself. I've been off for a couple of weeks. No, I know. I, know. I overplayed my hand and made myself <laughs> laugh. I understand. I understand. I'm your first. So I'm your first. You're my, you're my first ever. <laughs> I, I was trying to decide whether that I should take that as a compliment, and I decided not to. Why not? Um, <laughs> well, I don't know. I mean, first of all, it was a lot of pressure, so I couldn't, I couldn't handle the, 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 the pressure, the anxiety. That's actually why I came out, because it, yeah, the build-up yeah, yeah, gets yeah, intense, yeah, no, and you, just, you burst, and you have to come out. <laughs> but, um... <laughs> That's what I was thinking! Yeah. I like how they're still telling you to say, please welcome Adam Goldberg. Yeah, but, yeah, um, they're the saying the sign up. They usually they up. say wrap it up as soon as I come out, I've noticed. <laughs> anyway, so they're, anyway, go on. Well, the, I wanted the, to the do the email from the, the Kuala Lumpur person. Yeah, yeah. That, can I just say, by yeah, the way, that's yeah. a great mustache. You like that? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, thanks. I never leave home without some sort of facial hair. So, uh, today it was a mustache. Yesterday I had payases and... Uh, <laughs> What, what and, did you have for pay? Pay us of the curly uh, oh, juice Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> uh, but I had that with like an Aleister Crowley, like sort of Raleigh Fingers mustache. Nice. Just to kind of, you Whoa, know, where right. is he going? Yeah. But then, you know, I knew I was doing the program, so. You um, just went straight to. I just was straight to 70s Hustler. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> so, anyway. Can I, so yeah, yeah. You I ever been to Kuala Lumpur, by the way? I have no idea what that means. <laughs> is that an airline? No, it's a town. Oh, really? Yes, of course, Kuala Lumpur. <laughs> Kuala Lumpur. Uh, you in, went to school in, in Hollywood, in, didn't you? <laughs> Actually, North Hollywood. North Hollywood? Yeah, yeah, well, yeah, yeah, yeah. not even. Um, <clears throat> so where, where is that? Uh, New Zealand. Malaysia. <laughs> Kuala Lumpur, it's very... They've got the tallest building in the world there. I know a lot about Camus. I was just trying to think of, you know. All right then, Al uh, Jiz. Actually, let's go I know. Algerian existentialist. Let's do yeah, that know, then. All right then. Because uh, well, I wanted to read that email. No, no, it I want you to read it. I don't. Camus. I don't want to interrupt you. This is your first day back. I know it's a big thing. But you, I know you, you, do, you do. No, no, no. You do. You do. No, do. Do your thing. I'm just gonna. I'll. I'll be here. Uh, Jeff. Will, there's a camera right there. Yeah. Do you know that? <laughs> Ooh. Oh my God. <laughs> There he is. Yeah, there he is. Right Thank now, you. Yeah. Appreciate that. Number yeah. one. Yeah, the camera. Um, the cameras move. Yeah. No, I didn't realize I'm surrounded by them. <laughs> there's even. There's another one facing. Oh, it's. I see. It's Jeff has his own camera. Oh, but sure. But it's a totally yeah. different model of it's camera. It's a different type of camera. Yeah, yeah. for skeletons. Right. <laughs> yep. Right. All right. Anyway, I'm going to yeah, read this yeah, thing yeah, from Kuala Lumpur. Oh, right. Ready? All right. Uh, it's from Azir. All right. Uh, <laughs> I don't, I'm not going to make a joke about that name because, I mean, there's no, there's no politically correct version of a joke of that name. <laughs> That's why I was hoping you'd make right, one, right, actually. Right. Anyway, he says, dear Chris, Tootsie Fruits. No, 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 
I always like to see what they later on. Yeah. So are they, uh, Makes my mother really uh -oh, proud. Yeah, no. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> anyway, I'm from Azir in, Qua Azir. Azir in Kuala, Kuala Lumpur, Lumpur yeah, Port. which is in uh, New Zealand. Wait a minute. <laughs> Never mind. That right. Isn't that the? I just no. I just there's a CNN anchor. Who, oh no! I'm sorry. That's uh, Christiane Amanpour. Right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> and she's and she reports oftentimes from New Zealand. Oh, she's she's never out in New Zealand. She's always she's here. always in. Oh, right, 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 look right. what's happening now. Uh, New Zealand. Hobbits right. in the sheet. Right. Her right. sheet. <laughs> anyway, Azir in Kuala Lumpur. He says, "Dear Craig and Adam," he says, which is an amazing. Incredible coincidence. That he knew yeah. you were going to be. Here. <laughs> Would you go on a sailing adventure to another country or continent? Ah, is he? No. Are you asking me? Yeah, would you? Why not? You don't like sailing? Well... Oh, you don't I, like I, sailing? No, I like, I like. I've been to Catalina uh, a couple times. <laughs> I went, I went Why's there. Funny? I, I went to Catalina. Yeah, this. I know. It's, yeah. That's sailing. I was, I mean, I yeah. was 10. Um, <laughs> and it was unwittingly on some sort of school trip, but I went. <laughs> And I got there and I did it and I only got a little bit seasick for about half the time and the other time, I, the other half I don't remember much because the dram, I mean, really wipes a, <laughs> that'll wipe a 10 year old right on out. But, um, you're making me sad. I got hissed. You got hissed? Well, I think it might have been no, a laugh. No, the English like people, when they laugh, stuff whistles out their teeth. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that was funny. <laughs> um, so you would do that? You would take a... I went to Catalina last week on a sailboat. No, but would you take a big sailing adventure to a... Yeah, event? sure. You're darn right. I would. Right. I would take a little... I'd take a little mat oh, yeah, yeah. and I would sail it from the South America to, yeah. the po to the Polynesian Islands to prove that's how people traveled back in the day. Right. And I would call myself Thor Heyerdahl. Wow. <laughs> okay. I would... First, I would run 26 miles. All right. Okay. Then I would do. What's the What's the second thing you do in a triathlon? Pogo stick. Then I would pogo stick. <laughs> then I would swim. Carrying the pogo stick. Carrying the pogo stick to wherever the ship was docked, and then I'd do the the whole the whole thing. Your turn. <laughs> Your move. It was someone else's cocaine in my purse. Is that what you say? Man, I, I mean, I got. Have you met Paris? Paris is a lovely girl. I've had her on the show. It's lovely. She never seems high when she's you here. Had her on? She actually seems. She almost seems a bit bored when she's here. To be honest. Uh, I don't know if I've met her. I think she. I don't know. I don't know. Uh, Maybe in Kuala Lumpur one night? Yeah, yeah. I think we had a crazy night once at Tainted Eggs. Uh, <laughs> Do you know what? I just realized what would be fun for me. I should bring out dollar bills. And then when a guest says, I don't know, I should bring out a dollar bill and go, does this refresh oh, you? Oh, right, right, right. Uh, How about now? Wait, so she, so she said... Wait a minute. So she said it wasn't it wasn't her fault because it was her friend. Her friend's cocaine was in her purse. Yeah. Has she never seen Locked Up Abroad? <laughs> like oh, you just. Oh, like, oh, Michael's trying to get my attention. What? What, what is it? Someone? Is it cocaine? Oh, money. <laughs> now he's got money. Um, you want the money? Yeah, I'll take it. <laughs> it's been a slow summer. Thanks. How much is there? It's all right. You know, I'm I'm not proud. No, no, go ahead. Keep keep taking it. Okay. But thank you. Thank you. That's nice. Yeah, they, they, nice. they're enjoying that yeah. warm applause I, on your indignity. Yeah, I know. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> so, you, yeah, you met Paris Hilton once? Uh, I, no, I don't know. I think, I'm, I think she was at like a rap party of something I did many years ago. A drug related film, in fact. Oh, yeah. What uh, oh, yeah. A yeah, film what was called the... the Salt and Sea. I, I seem to recall. Didn't maybe she, see she made that be, movie. Yeah. I'm not sure. I, did. I didn't see that movie. <laughs> The Salt and Sea is one of the best movies. I, play, I played a speed freak named, named uh, Cujo. Played, Cujo, yeah. the character you played, was amazing. Yeah. He was a speed freak, right? Right, yeah. It was amazing. How did right. you get into that character? Right, it's interesting you should ask. I'm sorry, uh, we're out of time. Uh, yeah. <laughs> I mean, what kind of car is it? Was, what kind of car is it? It's an American car. <laughs> I like American cars. Okay, so yeah, it's a, it's a Mercury Marauder. <laughs> no, why is that I hated that movie. <laughs> no, I, I Mercury Marauder's a hey, good Hey, listen, car. they only made that car for two years. It's, uh, it's you know, they only made 5,000 of them. Why? I don't know that that's something I should be bragging why? about. Why did they only make 5,000? 
because you look fantastic. Did you get a haircut? <laughs> and you look tan and not that kind of orange fake tan that you usually look. <laughs> Do I usually look orange fake tan? No, see, that was meant to be. What I'm trying to say is, is that, that one would usually looks if... <laughs> I get it, buddy. I understand what you're saying. Um, so, yeah, the salt... I'm so salt and sea... Really? Uh, as I, as I realized I was about to go into a... You were going into a long... going into a story, a story about, about a movie that I did about 10 years ago. But you know what? Let's promote it, because I'm sure somewhere buried... <laughs> In my deal memo, where like, you know, you get these points a lot of times when you don't get paid a lot on the front end, you get a lot of back end points. Um, so I'm sure if, uh, I keep hearing, you, you hear that hissing sound, right? What hissing sound? There's, there, the air it's is, the the air is being let out of one of the audience members. Oh, he's funny, isn't he? <laughs> <Shh. laughs> oh boy. Um, We're out of time, you know. Yeah. Have you got anything to promote at all? Yeah, here's uh, one of those. Nope. I have a I have a record coming out in January, but it's far too early to discuss that. And uh, you don't want to come on here and, and play your songs, do you? No, I think I think I might do that actually. All right. Yeah. Do you and, need a mouth organ? Uh, I'm sorry. You heard me. I used to. Uh, I, I I stopped going to mouth organ actually in the in the late '90s. I started going to uh, change it act. The change yeah. Eggs, yeah. Um, I'm well, we hope this has been informative for you. Yeah. But it's everywhere. Right, Adam Goldberg, everybody. Adam, <coughs> Adam Goldberg, everybody. We'll be right back. We'll be right back. My first guest tonight is an actor. He's a musician. He's got a new album, The Goldberg Sisters, coming out this spring. Maybe he's got bigger news for us. Please welcome Adam Goldberg, everybody. Adam Goldberg. Very nice. Very you, look, nice. you look good, Adam. You've been working out a little bit. No, no, I haven't. I yeah, have, you have. I, I can see it across your chest. No, no, no. That's a... Uh, oh, you mean this? No, no, not that. That's oh, a T-shirt. But the yeah. Uh, yeah, no. This this has always just kind of just kind of been there from birth, you know. You were born with a barrel muscular I was, chest. I was born with a kind of a mannish chest. Really? Yeah, and uh, and, and a beard. And a womanly heart and a, and a big beard. Yes, <laughs> but ladylike fingers and hands. You're 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 almost halfway to being a lady already. I I'm absolutely, <laughs> and three quarters to being a fish. I like the way this is going. So, speaking of which. Speaking of which. I actually have an agenda today. You know, oftentimes, I've, I've been on the show a few times. Would you more say? More yeah. times than I care to. More times really? than I care to remember. Yeah. And oftentimes, you know, I don't have, I'm, I'm not plugging anything. I don't yeah, have any, you just, you come out here. I just come you, out here. I'm sort of become a rich little type figure. That's before many of the, the kids' time here. But uh, rich little was an, an impressionist. He probably still is an impressionist. No, he did the White House Correspondents' Dinner after the it's Stephen it's Colbert and before me. I bad. was very pleased that he was wedged in the middle there. So that's a bad example. <laughs> All right. Who's, a, who's an anachronistic dead guy who used to be on Carson? Um, uh, Liberace? I've become a sort of a Liberace figure. Yes, on, 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 you always have been to me. On the, on the, on the show, where, 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 you know, every time maybe somebody drops out or whatever, you bring the friend of the show on. And right, I'm right, right, right. Totally that's, comfortable that's, with that. Yeah, that's fine. Because any TV time for me. Right, is, good. Yeah, is, yeah, yeah, you know what I mean? I mean, this is not technically, this is like public access cable, right, but not, I get it's it. It's not today, it's not tomorrow yet, it's confusing. Right. right. We're in a way station. Okay. So anyway, so <laughs> this time I came, I came with real classic sort of talk show guests, you know, type implements. Do you have a movie or something? Uh, no, not really. Right, but, okay, uh, okay. You can get some stuff on, on DVD. But I have uh, I have a I have a plug, okay, which you sort of did already, which was which oh, is the, my oh, band, the, the, the band, Goldberg yeah. Sisters. Okay. Yeah, right, yeah. Oh, wait, 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 wait a minute, wait a minute. You haven't even heard this band yet. How do right. you know they're any good? Yeah. Not great. 
Okay. Okay. Um, Who's in the band then? You uh, and other girls? Well, it's me and and then on the record it was various. I I get it. Yeah, uh, no, I, I get it. I'm just gonna, noticed, I'm, pow I'm powering through. I've seen, no, no, I've I've seen, seen guests do this. They yeah. come with an agenda. They don't ad lib. They don't extemporize. They just they come here and they plug and they have. They want to. Yeah, no, like, they're like, oh, go and see yeah, my movie. Right, go and right, see my right. movie. Right. And like, and nothing here. There's nothing no, here. Right, right. No, please yeah. go and see my movie. Yeah, see my movie. See my movie. No, no, I'm gonna I'm gonna power through this stuff and then we're gonna get down to you know just talking about. Life Talking about just, yeah, fish. So, uh, Goldberg Sisters, whatever, okay, got you a t-shirt, got you a gift, that's you number a, two. A, a t this is a t-shirt? Yeah, but you can't take it out of the bag because it has, a, uh, well, even this does, they've censored my, uh, they censored her a little bit. Uh, Naked lady bits on it? Yeah, they, say they, they, they censored her nipples, which is funny because mine are fully erect, uh, and they didn't censor mine because it's so freezing well, your in nipples, here. Let's be honest, no one is remotely aroused sexually by your nipples, but they might be aroused by the drawing of this weird girl's nipples Always, here. always, always something hurtful, though, I feel. It's not, it's not hurtful. I look, think plenty of people have been aroused no, by my nipples. No, no, no. Look, even women that, that love you would right. say not, his strongest point is not, not his not nipples. His nipples right. Right. And I, they're going to say, I love Adam, he's so sexy, but those nipples. I, you know what, to be honest with you, it's come up a few times. Really? Well, they're inordinately small. You can Google it. Anyway, look. Um, <laughs> Okay, that, that's out of the way. You got the gift. You got right, the club. No, I'm looking forward to the album. When yeah. can the band be on right. the show? April. Yeah. Right. Okay, okay, okay. So that's done. We won't be on the air in April. But I. <laughs> I don't know if you caught the cold open, I, but I, I think we're done this week. Well, actually. I don't think there'll be a band in April. But anyway. All right. Okay. Fair enough. Well, that's, maybe you so, and I can form a band. I would love to form a band. That's great. You. That's I great. can. I you, can. You be... play the uh, Jew's harp, and I'll be a half Jew. <laughs> Awkward. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I, no. This is what I tried to avoid by having an agenda. What? See? what the awkward stuff? Okay, a little you awkward. can't avoid awkward on this show. It's right. what we do. It's okay. the awkward show. I, I know. No, you're. I realize that I'm going upstream in this. I understand okay. that. So, but I have an anecdote. I have an actual bona fide anecdote. An anecdote? I have an anecdote. You didn't buy a house or something, did you? No. In fact, if anybody wants to buy my house, one of the reasons that one, it's like it pertains to this anecdote, I got to get out of this house. Oh, really? What? There was a strange man in my kitchen at 3 a.m. This is a true story. You lucky bastard. <laughs> not, in goes the robot. Not. <laughs> Not a bad looking man. Really? Okay. No. Do you have a picture? I do. We do have, we have a police sketch. My girlfriend's an artist. She made this shirt, uh, and then she also made the. Did this. she draw the guy's nipples on the thing? Because we no, can't no, no. show it. Is. This is a police sketch. Which camera? Police sketch. Betty White. Wow. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. That's Andrew Garfield. Hold yeah, on a second. Right. Right. From oh, his, this is in the Facebook movie. Yeah. Th uh, there, there he is. He bore, bore a striking resemblance to Andrew Garfield. So we were. <laughs> this guy was in your kitchen. Look, she's well, a, she's under a lot of stress right no, now, so I this is the best I, that she could come up I with. I think that clearly your yeah. house is located right on the edge of the Lord of the Rings somewhere. <laughs> no, but that's funny that you say that. Why? Because I thought this guy was... Okay, so here's the whole... i got to give you the whole thing, right. right? And if you want... If you have any information... This is for real. We formed a website. It's going live tonight by the time your show's on the air. Apparently, you can't plug No, no, no it's, it's live on the... What the hell, man? Right. <laughs> You mean right now? No, no, no. There's this space-time continuum thing All right, because, yeah, yeah. They, because of the time shift, Eastern Daylight Time. That's right. right, right exactly. Okay. And there's a, there's been a very minimal orbit issue. And right. so anyway, uh, you know, th this I think you know it's kind of good looking. That's what I'm trying to tell you. I, as I was wielding my guitar and screaming at him, and oh he, boy, I, yeah. now you're scaring me. No, I know. <laughs> That's what I'm telling you. You know, it wasn't, you know, it's, it's all I had, you know, at my disposal, right? Okay, all right. And, and I'm sorry adrenaline. to walk. I'm no, not walking. No, it's okay. It's all right. right. It's, there's been, it's been plenty of time. I'm over it. It happened Saturday. But, um... <laughs> But uh, no, the, the, the point is, is I kept thinking, what is the guy from the Facebook movie doing in my kitchen and why is he scaring us at 3 a.m.? You know, this guy here. I mean, this is basically the guy, you know? I mean, this is, this is a nice <sighs> attempt, but this is basically the I guy. I can't keep up with this. All right, so anyway, so Andrew Garfield from no, the Facebook I, I, movie I, I, was in... I, no, I want a commercial break. Uh, <laughs> oh, no. That's it, huh? Yeah, I want a commercial break. Uh, okay. But well, then we'll come back and okay, talk we'll come some back more about the guy in your kitchen. Okay. But, uh, yeah, it's time for a break. Okay. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Unless you want to, you know, keep going. I, I'm, I'm completely done. Well, you can't be completely done. We get more to do after the commercial break. Oh, that's terrific. What happened? Aren't there any other? Uh... <laughs> they uh, really didn't turn up. <laughs> no, we have other. Wait, do we have another guest tonight? 
Oh, well, there you are. Oh, then. it's terrific. But you're still back after the break. Ah, okay. All right. Because we have to cut out all that stuff about what you said. <laughs> go That's boom, amazing. Right back. Is that true? Actually, I'm just hearing the story about no. the guy who wandered in your house. Sounds like terrifying. No, it, it was a, it was a terrifying thing, and I'm just trying to make lemons lemonade. I'm so sorry that I mocked. <laughs> Scratch that. Reverse it. I'm trying to make uh, lemons lemonade. out of lemonade. No, yeah, you lemonade. Know you right, right. Yeah, you can't Most make of my lemons life, out of lemonade. I've made lemons out of lemonade. Right. Tonight, you, I'm trying to make. Right. Do you ever make lemonade? Uh, no, not a big fan. Do you have a blender? I do have a blender. Do I used to have the one that does the 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 magic the magic bullet. What's that called? Or is that the JFK assassination theory? <laughs> Is that what it's called? It's been a long, long time, guys. No, it's guys. not been long enough for really? you to start talking <laughs> like that. No, um, it's not, it was nothing to do with a blender. No, okay. So anyway, yeah. I have that little one that they advertise <clears throat> to make smoothies, and it broke within, uh, I don't know, like three weeks or whatever. And I think that whenever the guarantee runs out. That well, do you, do, why you, do you get your juicy drinks now? Uh, well, I got a bigger, I got a proper blender. It's not you got magic. A big, a big giant blender? Yeah, I got you also put, the, uh, you yeah. put your vegetables in there? No, vegetables no. blended? Do no. you put meat in there? Have meat blended? you have no. meat blended? No. Do no. You have all, so you have all your meals then are in liquid form? I blend everything, all like sort of 2001 style. Is that how you get that? Luscious hair. It is. <laughs> you aren't dying your hair, are you? I, you're you're going to have to deal with that soon. That I mean, because you you're getting, that. Yeah, yeah, you're getting to that age. It's, uh, it's going to start turning. Look what happened to mine. No, I've noticed. Yeah. I know. Yeah. <sighs> My hair used to be the same color as yours. No, and then... I know that. They were showing clips, you know. They do that before the show, right? Right, 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 right. And I was like, one of them was like from last year. Right. You, you, pulled, you pulled an Obama, Yo, didn't you? Oh, man, it's gone, yeah. yeah. This is what happens. It's just, you know what it is? The stress. The stress of I not understand. having a decent job. No, I did. <laughs> I know. I'm surprised my hair's not white. Um, but yeah, no, I I have started to notice that there's it's and it's not even like I don't mind salt and pepper. It's turning into like little, you know, sort of streaks. Well, that's how it starts. Yeah. Uh, and then you get the feels. But well, really, when it starts, is it was on my chest. Oh God. Yeah. That's no, what it that, started. Yeah, yeah. It's what bad. happened? What about down? Uh... Oh, downstairs. Yeah. Yeah, we're still pretty good down there so far. Because that, I feel like, that I would die. That I could... No, I don't think, man. Really? You, you, no, you can get uh, wigs. <laughs> <laughs> they make... What are those things called? Uh, didn't, they used to have... They used to have, actually, they're called Merkins. Merkins, that's yeah, right. Yeah, right. Right. I wanted to have my band called Merkin, but we, we decided... No, no, it's not. not. Because you're, just, you're putting people off. Yeah, no, that's you, the, you, my specialty, I mean, apparently. No, no, no. <laughs> The thing is, you, you've got to be a little more marketable, is what I'm saying to you. Okay. You a little more marketable. All right. All right. Okay. For, first off, you know... Change my name to Smith. No, no, Founder no, of no, economics. You don't have to go that far. Oh, okay. No, I'm just like, more sit up straight. Okay. <laughs> there, that's about it. That's all you need to do. <laughs> no, see? Look at that. There you go, right there. Right there. Don't try and look like you just did something in All your right. pants, though. How's this? That's, that's really Terrific. Good. Fantastic. So, uh, I, my, my wife and I took a wonderful vacation uh, in the islands. I don't know if you've been to the islands. <laughs> So oh, great. wonderful, wonderful, yeah, yeah. wonderful. Now it's like a real talk show. It's terrific, yeah. terrific. You, you guys are terrific. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Jeff, always a pleasure. Yeah. <laughs> Bulls. Yeah. And then he ruins it. Yeah, and then he ruins now it. Now then it just becomes sort of slouchy and hipster. Yeah. yeah, yeah, no. yeah I you know. are quite a hipster. No, 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 no. Yeah, no. a little bit. Listen, I'm old, man. I'm hip. It's different. You, you, you know what I mean? No, I don't it's, know. I think you're a hipster. No, 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 no. I'm, a, I'm, I'm hip-ish. It's different. It's hip -ish? different. I'm hip-ish, or you know, hip-ish, hip-ish. Not quite a hippie. Not quite a hipster. Just hip-ish. You know, like Jew-ish. <laughs> like Brit-ish. Like Brit-ish. Right, Brit-ish. Like if you're not really British, but you're Madonna. You're Brit-ish. Yeah. Right. You know I mean? That is an interesting thing that happened with her, isn't it? That her accent turned to that. That was right. like me starting to go, "Hey, how are you doing, everybody? Hey, you like you're, gum? How you doing? Yeah, yeah. How you doing? How you doing? Yeah. How you doing? Yeah. All right. Yeah, no, welcome to the show. Hey. Yeah. No, hey, I'm, all, I'm in Los Angeles. Hey. I'm all, 
Hey. I moved over there. I moved here. Now I'm here. I'm in Los Angeles. Hey. It's the wrong accent. What are you going to do? Ah, yeah. yeah. Forget about it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, oh, that was the least Italian thing that ever happened on the show. Hey! Not Speaking, though, of uh, so soft, mm. so soft. I'm known for my soft knees Wait and my beautiful nipples. What? what? Every, everything is sent. This yeah, is censored? Yeah, well, one night I drew a penis on the bottom of the yes. snake, and then they censored it. Right, right. I wonder why. I can't imagine why they would do that. Same reason they taped the nipples. Yeah, I know, they put a, put a piece of yeah. tape over. Yeah. I mean, the thing of it is, it's all, it's sort of, de I mean, you know. Oh, they, they don't, just, you know, know they know. just, they're just doing their jobs. No, I know. Yeah. Now I know how Jim Morrison felt, you know, when he was on, uh, he was on uh, what, the Ed Sullivan show, you know. No, oh, right. Yeah. <laughs> so, it, <laughs> the problem so is. So, Jim. Right. You got those tight packs there. I don't know, Craig. I just feel like I just I just feel like Craig. And I, I just, Adam Goldberg, everybody. Thank you. Be right back. <laughs> My first guest is an actor slash musician. It's not slash because he's not an actor. <laughs> It's an actor slash musician. He's got a new album, The Goldberg Sisters, which is in stores now. Please welcome Adam Goldberg, everybody. Adam Goldberg. All right. It's good to see you. Man, I like this. It's really nice. It's like a tactile, right? You know what it's like? It's like the uh, it's like the I fabric feel, on a lazy did boy. Did you move these? What? I feel I like they're. I feel like I'm doing Commedia dell'arte. Oh, I'm sorry. Yeah, I know. I, know. I, I, I don't talk to French, pal. But if that means your seat's still facing sideways, then I yeah. I like to open the show with really obscure theatrical references. And the audience also likes it when I open the show with obscure theatrical references. Well, they were already pretty weak, but you finished them off. Uh, <laughs> that was it, huh? The 22-minute mark. Yeah, I don't know what happened. They just kind of fell away. It's you said something in French, and they're like, screw this guy. I understand. Said, yeah. <laughs> now, i got to tell you something. I'm a, I'm a bit worried about your album. Okay, I understand. It's very small. It is, it is. We tried to make... We tried to make it larger, but uh, it doesn't fit into the computer that way. We tried to make like the, the wax. Yeah, yeah, the wax cylinder with a little with a giant it's uh, got the rings on it and that kind of thing. You know, uh, uh, records. You yeah. almost touched my penis there. Do you know that? <laughs> no, I'm serious. No, I mean like I know you went to just kind of like go like that, but right. what happened was that you I was sitting a little closer than you thought, Craig. and you just kind of like nudged, nudged. I'm lo I'm looking now. You you nudged the tip, dude. I'm looking now. You did. And you did, and I was like, whoa. Let me just say that you're being very, very liberal with, uh, with your assessment of it, because I'm looking, I was looking minutes ago, and I gotta tell you folks, no, nowhere near it. I, Enjoy your drink. <laughs> Subliminal message. Enjoy your show. I have no idea what that means. That's all right. Uh, you know what you got to do with your album? You, gotta, you can't keep slapping it because it's, uh, there's a CD in there. If you're going to slap it, you got to take the CD out. You're not going to be able to listen to it. No. Look, oh, no, no. It even, look, it even says disc. For, for people like you, disc, poster. And you're like, in there and there. See, there's a little arrow and everything. Oh, there's, a, there's a poster in here, too? Yeah, yeah, but it's on the side where it says poster. Well, let me see the poster. Oh, it's going to sure. be a pretty small poster to fit in here. Unless <laughs> Right. The Goldberg yeah. Sisters, by the way, is there something you want to tell us? Uh, well, <clears throat> this is your poster? <laughs> that's, that's it? That's your poster? Uh, Wait! Let me judge you harshly. <laughs> this, this is your poster? Because actors who make music never get judged. So, no, it's good. Enjoy yourself. No, 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 to be fair, I never brought that up. You brought that up. No, listen, the music is quite terrible. Oh, but, man. But, <laughs> What did I say? I don't cuss on the show anymore. Oh, stop that? Yeah. I was just on here in January. Yeah, I stopped last week. Are you kidding? So what? <laughs> like, so you, you never say, ever say, Groggy. No. All right. But then there's sometimes, sometimes you, you I do. say, it. Yeah, yeah, but during the commercial break. But that's a that's a that's a bad that's a, that's a bad one though. You know what I mean? With that word? Yeah, I mean because I feel like nah. tootsie fruitsie. 
not so bad, but you know what I mean? I, they're, they're, nobody's gonna know they're gonna tootsie fruitsie all right, over right, you, right. yeah. <laughs> What do I get? Because a long time ago, I think I got a League Vault, but I don't yeah, know yeah. if they still personalize it no, for No, I think it's a Tootsie Fruitsie, and we got a Tootsie Fruitsie, and, uh, and there's a rainbow flag, and when you, and it, that goes, uh-oh, like that. Yeah. Oh, really? Like, hello! Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like yeah, that? Yeah, 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 I like that one. See, these are, these are some... These are, and these are the words to your song? These are some, those are the words to the song. And uh, that's always... Anyway, we could, we can move, we can no, move No, no, let me on. look at some of the words to the songs. <laughs> Yeah, this is a. Which I'm finding this really. Moving. You know, I turned. We had the car turn around to pick up the CD. I wasn't going to bring the CD. No, you know, no, they, that's and right. they called no. us. Did you have the CD? And I. No, we, no, we no. Had, I like. We this. had the car turned around Ooh, just, just so I could. Look at you with your things late. to say about stuff. Uh huh. <laughs> no, it's good actually. I know it's not fair to read out lyrics without the music. No, no, no. Because uh, things sound a little odd, you know, when you. Really? Do you, you think? No, no, they're good. No, no. no let's find. Let's find something. All right. Let's find something. Um. I try to. I try to. Do you have any music? Maybe I can read along. Do you have any you got, well, I'll music? Make, no, no, I'll do some. Hey, hold on. Okay, there you okay. go. Right. Okay. okay. Ready? <laughs> okay. Ready? Tell me when you're ready. Okay, go. <laughs> Photography, Adam Goldberg. Design, Roxanne Daner. <laughs> Legal, Doug Mark, Mark Music and Media Law. <laughs> thank you, thank you, Kevin Wordis, Francois Moray, Pius. Copyright 2011. This is terrible. This is terrible. I, uh, Don't you dare. It sounds that. much better. It sounds a lot better when I sing it, though. No, no, no. It'll be good. You were just reading out the credits to the album, weren't you? No, no, no. That, yeah. Those were those were some lyrics. I, 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 I find legalese to be very sort of emotionally kind of, uh, you know, sort of moving and inspiring. My, you know, my last record was called, you know, was was this called a record called Landy, and the title was Eros and Emissions. Uh, which is a, which is a double entendre of which you were speaking. We don't earlier. do double entendres here. When we say wiener, we mean wiener. When we mean penis, we say penis. Okay, so that reminds me. I did not come prepared with an anecdote because you don't do that. I don't know if if you know that. There's no pre-interview, and you're pretty much <laughs> you come out and you're you're pretty well screwed. Yeah. Um, <laughs> but that reminds me. Um, I, you just bought a house. Uh, <laughs> We've been we've been over this five uh, years ago, but t top peak of the market. If anybody wants this thing, um, <laughs> anyway. So did you really? Yeah, it's a long story. I was, oh, okay, I was going. Sorry, yeah. I was having some 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 interpersonal issues, and I found myself without a without a home. Not homeless, but without a home in which I lived. Homeless ish. <laughs> anyway, it was the peak of the bubble. I've been divorced twice. Yeah. Yeah. yeah how'd that go for you? Do you miss it? Two houses. The divorces? Yeah. Do I miss the divorces? Um, no, I don't miss the divorces. So, you ever miss the women? Yeah. I mean, nobody's watching. <laughs> you're covering your entire face. I can't read you when you're... When, when you're... No. no. No, you don't. <laughs> so... Come on, man. You know, you know I don't like giving up personal information on the show. <laughs> Do you really... No, I don't give a shit. Tootsie Fruits. Oh! 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 Why you? There, there you were. You, you, you lulled me into a false sense of security. Before I knew it was doing, I cussed. And now I've broken my cuss-free record of almost three shows. Uh-oh. <laughs> it's like you're toying with me, it's, man. It's, it's like a, you're toying with me. It's a sad Ooh, la, la. day. Oh! It's a sad day. Um... So, no, what it reminded me of, <clears throat> when you were speaking of double entendres, I'm just... De I'm just I've just really had a great idea. I've had What's a great that? idea. Right. You should uh, get your band, the Goldberg Sisters, right? right mm -hmm. And bring them onto the show and play music on the show. Like a real talk show with a band on it. <laughs> Come on, man, it could work. You get, call up the guys and the band, it's, it's guys, whatever, and you call them up and you say, hey, I've got us a, a gig on TV, they won't know it's this show, right. and then you just come and you, you play here. Can I tell them it's Carson? <laughs> Look, I'm not saying don't, don't right. tell them it, it, it's Carson, but they might smell a rat. Right. <laughs> does, tell, I know does, tell them. Does Jeff still work? No, I don't think so. Oh, yeah, yeah, there he is. <laughs> Jeff, should I bring uh, my, my uh, musical venture, the Goldberg Sisters, onto the program next yeah, week? Yeah, babe. Oh, well, there you are. 
Yeah. You okay. should. You All should right. bring. You bring the band on. And but we tell have them. to practice. That was the thing. The thing is, there's no, there's no band per se. In other words, I like, I, I, I make the music. Right. And then with different people, but there's no like, there's no like, you know, oh, we're playing over, you know, we're playing at uh, uh, the Troubadour, you know, the Peach Pit, right? Right, the exactly. Peach Pit, oh, the right, Peach exactly. Pit, even big, uh, bigger than the Troubadour, right. yeah. But um, but we did play a couple weeks ago at a at a, at a show uh, for. But for, wait, how could you if there was no band? Well, because I got I I I hastily assembled people and we right. had four rehearsals. Hastily and we assembled people like Doctor Frankenstein. <laughs> saying then is your band is yeah. made up of body parts yeah. of dead people that you have reanimated? Yeah. This could be the greatest thing in rock and roll ever! Let's do it! Yeah! yeah. Next yeah. week! Goldberg Sisters! Yeah! So, we'll do that then. Okay. The Goldberg Sisters will All be right. on the show next week and they're made entirely oh. of reanimated dead right. bodies. That's right. Especially, well, especially well. the keyboard player. Sorry, pal. Um, return my emails. Yeah. Um, but, uh, all right. We're out, of, we're out of time. We're out of time. But you, come back. Do we have a date next week? Yeah, we do. I was about to tell you about the snake in my therapist's office. All right, fine. No, it's fine. Why I'll, do it? I'll, 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 you know what? I'll write a song write about it. Write a song about it. And, and I'll sing it next week. Yeah, right, right. Okay. All right. Now, quickly, a mouth organ or awkward pause? Uh, I would prefer an, an awkward pause. <laughs> okay. That is too much. <laughs> and it plays piccolo. I can't believe that. You, <laughs> you would think that just playing piano was enough. How's <laughs> fat? Hi. I was just looking at this. It's a DVD. No, it's not. Oh, damn, what is it? A CD. Anyway, look, it's from the band who are here making their late night debut, here to perform Shush off their self titled album. Please welcome the latest musical enterprise from the very handsome Adam Goldberg. The Goldberg Sisters, everybody. The Goldberg Sisters.
Casey, welcome back to the ladies and gentlemen, Jeff. Welcome back, everybody. Welcome back, everybody. <laughs> <laughs> Don't start showing appreciation now. <laughs> you bunch of bastards! Ah, you bunch of bastards! Do you think you're great, but you're no great yet? Dingo baby! <laughs> My first guest tonight is a very talented actor and musician. Sort of. <laughs> no, yes, he he's really very, very nice man. Very clever, very good, lovely hair. Good friend of the show. Please welcome Adam Goldberg, everybody. <laughs> Welcome, welcome, Adam. What are you doing? I just thought maybe you needed some of this. No, no. What's no. that? Is that one of the emails? Uh, yeah, it's the woman who's, uh, uh, she's, her boyfriend hasn't proposed, but she's planning the wedding in advance anyway. Oh, that's sad. Well, <laughs> it's a little tricky. Yeah, it is. You look a little weird. Do I really? Oh, you're doing the yeah, Canadian the, tuxedo? Well, no, it's a little bit like, you know, Jay Leno and the day off. What's going on? <laughs> Well, uh, we we just drove cross country from uh, we being we Roxanne, uh, my my girlfriend and I. Your girlfriend and our three Have dogs. you proposed to her yet? Because well, she you know, she may be planning the wedding. Anyway. I wasn't. I wasn't going to do this, but which camera? No, man, don't no. no really? Bad idea. No, no don't okay, do it. Right. Do, okay, do it. Do it. Um, little rating spike, and then they find out it's me who did it. No, uh, no, I'll be fine. So you just drove across the country. Yeah, we drove. We got back Thursday, and uh, our stuff from New York, where I was living and working for five months, hasn't arrived. I'm not going to mention the moving company's name because they're still sort of holding our stuff captive. Right. Um, and anything. But you know, in the car, you can pack a suitcase or two with clothes. We have three yeah. dogs and a Prius. <laughs> what? What's a Prius? I, I, it's a good question. I'm still not quite sure. No. So it's, you, a, it's like a golf cart um, with neg negligibly worse gas mileage. No, oh, come on. No, it's a, a no. It's a fine, yeah. fine Japanese hybrid. Yeah. Uh, why did you can drive you a Japanese you've got, Yeah, you can say Japanese hybrid. Yeah. It's a little bit like what's that coming? I go right. <laughs> That's some. That, what? It's the same thing. <laughs> You're going, uh, you're going blue tonight. I'm going a little blue tonight, yeah. I'm trying to keep the audience awake. Mm -hmm. I'm failing, but I'm trying. Oh, that's good. Yeah, if the AC doesn't do it. No, you know, some are, you, are you cold in here? I'm always a little nipply. <laughs> do you find one of your nipples is more sensitive than the other one? Um, or the other one? Because I, I know you famously have three. <laughs> that's not a nipple. I've told you what that is. Okay. Just, um, I, uh, no, you know... Alas, neither of them are as sensitive as I've heard some men's are. I may not that sensitive. Yeah. I mean, I, I'd sat through Warhorse topless, not a, nothing. You, you, you sat through Warhol? Warhorse. I, I watched oh, Warhorse. Very, very, oh. very moving film, and my, my nipples didn't weep once. Really? Yeah. Like, uh, you mean lactation? Sympathy lactation. When nipples weep? When nipples weep. Have you seen that? When That's a great weep. movie. It's, when nipples were, oh, yeah. that's fantastic. No, Kurosawa, it was, isn't it? it, was, yeah, it was, yeah. uh, that's a, I, huge, you love the art house. Huge, I do love the art yeah, house yeah. films, and I'm, I'm, uh, yeah, it was a huge at Sundance. I, I was going to ask why did you drive across, but be, because, because Roxanne they wouldn't pay for has your... a gigantic uh, dog, uh, like 95 pounds, and she doesn't want to put him in the in the cargo. Oh, I have that same problem. Yeah. I have a large 120 pound really? dog. Really? Yeah, but I was thinking of just giving him a hat and a ticket. <laughs> uh, that's what we said. We said like a little like a, yeah. a, a pipe and a, like a Sherlock Holmes hat. Yeah, and just get him on the plane. Well, you can't, but or I don't... you do the like and just say that you need the, I mean that's not nice. That's not, you can't. Yeah, you, no, yeah. you'll cut that later. Um, <laughs> but you can't say that it's a special needs dog and I get very anxious when I fly so I thought perhaps, you know, I, like I needed Ludlow, you know, when I flew. Right. Ludlow's uh, the name of the dog? Yeah, Ludlow's the name. You of named dog. a dog after a small town in Vermont? <laughs> Well, actually, I didn't know. Yeah. Roxanne named it after, I believe, a street where she used to. Well, but that's we're, just, we're getting way off track. No, here. no, no. I think, I, think, I think the track we should be on is Roxanne. I've never met Roxanne. You, right, you met her in the hallway. Well, okay. I only met her once in the hallway. I... So you, met you, guys... the, you met her the last time I, I ever smoked on this show, I believe. That... I mean, not on the show, but prior to the show. Oh, that's right. Was yeah. that your last cigarette? It was my last cigarette ever, but it was but the last haven't... time I was on, a, on, on your show. Well, when, when was the last time you had a cigarette? Uh, well, strictly speaking, I quit two years ago, but the last cigarette I had was about a year and a half ago. So but strictly speaking, like, you stopped a year, year and, and a half, half ago. ago. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, I'm, I had like five little breakdowns, and I couldn't even finish the cigarette. You know, I sort of like, I, I kind of wanted to start again. Right. And it didn't take. What about the electric cigarette? That, I tried that. Yeah, how is it? Mm. 
Well, when it dangles from your lips, it just falls. You know, it falls too heavy. <laughs> it's weighted funny. So, because part of the thing with smoke, I didn't like smoking, but I smoked for many years just because I didn't know what to do with my hands. My fingers were sort of naturally kind of, you know. You, you can make friends if you do that. Yeah. <laughs> and so I was sitting like this anyway, but you put a cigarette in there and then it made right. sense. Or, you know, when it dangled. But this thing, you couldn't dangle. You couldn't look cool. I didn't look that cool. Anyway. Well, no one's going to look cool in, with an electric cigarette. You just no, look I know. Like that's an the thing. Idiot. And also, yeah. they, they advertise it like, oh, you can use it on a plane. Do you honestly think that this day and age, if you put this kind of metal, rod in your mouth and some weird mist starts emitting from it yeah and you say oh no don't worry it's metal it's a metal cigarette uh, yeah, don't worry about it yeah it'll be fine on the plane no no it's not gonna in work in the middle of you know a restaurant or something like, you know a restaurant that's oh what you'll never get in yeah There's a, you're a party of four and we only have a table for six that's what i want you just reminded me doing, doing that scott i mean you always are sort of doing scott sorry a little yeah. bit yeah um but on the way uh on the way here we tried to learn french from some podcast um i mean i've tried for for many years i even went so far as dating a French girl for I remember years. when you dated that French yeah, girl. Yeah. yeah, and that, I mean, it was really, she doesn't know this, but it, <laughs> it was really just a, a, a kind of, a, in lieu of being able to afford Berlitz lessons, she and I went out. Right, okay. Um, but uh, it's a tough room. But Yeah, I'm, very I'm tough room, yeah, yeah, yeah. You're so, on your own. Yeah, I, I, I know that. I'm well yeah. aware of that. You can pad that later with something from, you know. <laughs> oh, yeah. You come to the wrong uh, place. We got nothing you here, got nothing pal. Yeah, yeah. No, no. <laughs> So, uh, but this, it turns out, that I was like, what is with this guy's accent? Is that really how you're supposed to speak French? He has, he was... French Canadian. Very Scottish. Oh, really? Very Scottish. Oh. Yeah. Uh, I can't do a good Scottish accent. So well, you I, hear, so you hear, yeah. 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 All right, so now we're going to say, can you please find the boulangerie for me? You know, I, uh, it's like the... That's I, a Pakistani I accent. Know, you know, 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 Pakistan. Know. Jeff, did you hear that? Don't go, what I know. Hell? Don't what go, the hell, man? Don't go on a talk show and do an accent and then not do an accent, right? Oh, with your weeping nipples, shy yeah, you, with your weeping nipples. He, so he's he's better like programmed lately. Like, oh yeah, no, whole, he's, he's, he's got he's, a much greater facility. He's, for he's the only one in a twenty mile radius that likes me. It's incredible. <laughs> But he, you can really kind of, he's like a proper, he's a proper sidekick. Now. He's a skeleton robot. Yeah. Uh, yeah. I mean, just. I don't need your assessments, Goldberg. Right. Yeah. <laughs> he's never, I don't even think he's ever referred to me by name before. No, no, no. He's, uh, he's, uh, he's probably mad at you, I think. No, he probably is a little bit. You know, you look with a trumpet, kind of a Doc Severinsen deal. <laughs> you, you guys familiar with Doc Severinsen? It's really, I'm not. I don't think these guys are familiar with television. <laughs> well, yeah. it's quiet now. Yeah. <laughs> Are you, uh, do you enjoy commercials? Uh, do I enjoy commercials? You want to go to one? Yeah. yeah. Sure. <laughs>
But I'm gonna try. I, I'm gonna try this box in your head. Is that how? It? Oh, that's the big cash prize. You wanna go for that? I I could use the yeah, because the, the gas money. <laughs> what time is it, Shadow Steven? It's time for the big cash prize. Big cash prize. All right, Adam. Fifty American dollars. Two. Wait, don't touch the money until you earn it. Fifty dollars. Two ways until you can either answer a simple question or. You can guess what's in my box. What happens during that is I imagine a box in my head and then there's something in it. I don't know what it is. Only Jeff knows. You tell me what it is. We check with Jeff. If it's the right answer, you get the $50. If it's the wrong answer, you're punished. <laughs> but Jeff is not a fan of mine. Jeff is completely impartial when it comes to guessing what's in the box. <laughs> <sighs> okay, all right. Let's, I'm going to guess what's in your box. All right, then. I'm imagining a box. I'm imagining a box. Well, don't you imagine oh, a box? Okay. Yeah. Well, if you imagine a box, then it might, uh, you know, Jeff might, uh, might think well, what's in I your box. I was imagining your box. Well, don't imagine my box. How dare you? <laughs> Roxanne is backstage. She'll be furious. Okay, I'll imagine her box. Don't, don't imagine. No, don't do that. No, no, okay. Don't imagine her. Well, because a box can yeah, be. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Give me any. Well, look, don't imagine any boxes. I'll do All the right. box. Okay. <laughs> All right, there's a box in my head. Okay, there's something in it. Dingo. What? Dingo. Dingo? Dingo is correct. Go! Oh, very good. Go, 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 go. Uh, the, uh, my, my first guest tonight is on a new CBS show. Poor bastard. Uh, <laughs> It's called NYC 22, which premieres this Sunday at 10 p.m. Please welcome the adorable, handsome, and smells like biscuits, Adam Goldberg, everybody. Adam Goldberg. Man, I hardly recognize you. Yeah, I know. I'm working. Yeah, I can see that. Like, I'm here to promote a television yeah, program. Yeah, I can see Usually you turn up here, but once a month, you're all yeah. raggedy and wearing jeans and going, hey, I heard a podcast. It yeah. was awesome. Look at you. Your hair's cold. Wow. You're wearing slacks. Is that, is that slacks well, you're wearing? Well, let me be clear about something. These are Wrangler pants. They're about $35. Okay. This, however, Paul Smith. Whoa. So now the show has to get picked up because I'm in deep trouble otherwise. <laughs> You went ahead and bought the jacket trouble. before you know the show is going to be a hit. Yeah, basically that's what that's what that's, that's, that's you what really thing combed I do. your hair as well. Have you done I really mistake? really brushed. I actually brought a brush to the show. It's in my dressing room along with Steve Jones's shirt, which was in there for some reason. Uh, Steve um, Jones was here earlier in the week. Yeah, and it's okay. It's all right. We can share a dressing room. Um, <laughs> listen, I don't. I know we have a whole thing, and we're here for business, and we got to you know. Who? who, who well, me? all right. <laughs> so the the royal way. All right. But I got it. Can I ask the girls, the blondes, something? No, no, I, I don't. I, I have some information that you may not. Uh, you may not want to talk to the girls. Really? Mm. Why is that? Oh, you know. Oh, <laughs> that's not. That's not what I'm referring to. I just wanted to know if they happen to be in an ice cream section at a supermarket in Los Feliz on, I think it was like, uh, two days ago. Did you guys go ice cream shopping the other day? <laughs> With very, like, Scandinavian accents, you know, so, so far as I can you tell. You're a creepy man. Yeah, I know. <laughs> He's got a picture of blonde girls buying ice cream. Well, that, I want to I wanna contextualize this first. Uh, right? All right, I am a creepy man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. But I just want to contextualize Do you have angry it. birds on this? Because uh, no. I, I could play it while you're talking. <laughs> yeah. um, I'm, I'm in airplane mode, so I don't know what happens. Oh, I right, didn't want right. to get any call, you know. Yeah, yeah. But um, what happened is, is that there were these, these sort of Scandinavian women. Yeah, they're, no, they're, I, they're, there's some know, over there, right, yeah. yeah. Very blonde. Mm -hmm. You guys would consider yourself fairly blonde, right? Mm -hmm. Tan, healthy. You mm -hmm. know, this is very, all very foreign to me. And, um, <laughs> and they're in that particular, I don't think I can say the name of the ice cream, but it's something that's got a sort of Scandinavian. Hagen dazs There you go. Got it. <laughs> There's lots of umlauts in the name, and I just, and they were there for- Are you allowed to say that? I think you'd say umlaut. Can you say umlaut on TV? <laughs> I know what an umlaut is. Can you say- It's, it's like a clitoris. Right. <laughs> it's the- It's a mythical creature. It's the, <laughs> it's the, it's the clitoris of grammar. Right, right, yeah. right. Um, so anyway, they were there for like an eternity, and it was just, it was just incredibly ironic. So yeah, I had to, I had to sort of perv them with the, with, with my phone. 
But it's not. No, it wasn't. Guess. It wasn't you guys. I could tell. No, it was. It was I think uh, LA Total is overrun distinct. by hordes of. Uh, Horde? Horde? I'm sorry, hordes. Great, great herds. Uh, yeah, yeah. Herds, herds. Herds, uh, herds. Uh, herds of uh, herds. Scandinavian women right. all over LA, all enjoying ice cream. I didn't know that until the other day. I mean, yes. I'm thrilled. You, to know. Well, it's uh, it's nice. Well, you better tell me about the show. It's on CBS. <laughs> Gosh, diggity. Uh, <laughs> yes, it's on CBS. <laughs> I feel like Patty Hearst. Nah, nah, you're all right, man. Uh, it's all right. Yeah, you, uh, you yeah. What's, what do you want to know about the show? Oh, We've never me, been able to plug anything. I don't know how it works. Yeah, tell me how awesome it is. <laughs> it's a great new cop show on Sunday night on CBS. Do you play a cop? Yes, I play a, a rookie officer. A bit really? Older. Yeah, I play an ex like journalist, a crime a crime writer who gets fired from his job from a newspaper because they don't make those anymore. And, co and things then, are so bad in the NYPD that right. they're, taking they're taking guys who guys get fired are, from yeah, newspapers. Exactly. Who are like a little yeah, a little long in the tooth and right. and, uh, and I'm like kind of a drunk and I'm kind of you know I'm kind of messed up. Are we still no. talking about the show here or just? Uh... <laughs> Well, we're talking about typecasting. Yeah, yeah, kind of. Yeah. A little bit. No, no, no. You know I'm not a drunk. I'm a pill popper. <laughs> that is true. I'm a junkie. Let's yeah. be clear about that. Well, that's why you've, that's why you've kept your figure. <laughs> that is, uh, that is, that. Yes, <laughs> scares. That, that and, uh, actually, it was funny that you were talking about that, uh, talking about bird dinosaurs and that kind of thing. Oh, yeah, yeah. We, uh, we, the audience loved I that. When I was talking I, about the bird dinosaurs, they were like, more of that, please. <laughs> right. We came all the way from Scandinavia I got for this. more, man. I got a call back for that. Oh, yeah? Yeah, I was on a paleo diet for about three days last week. You know what that is? Paleo diet? It's like when you just eat uh, meat and kind of like no grains, and it's incredibly strict, and you can't have, you can't have any kind of like uh, nuts, and it's, 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 it's awful. Well, you, you can't you can have eat. any, you can't have, oh, how awful that must be, you can't have any nuts. What the hell? No, no, you can't, you can't have, you, I mean, I, I no, probably no, no, go no. for weeks without having nuts. No, no, I, but you can't. And I'm not on a diet. You can't have rice. Or anything like that. Kind of rice or nuts? Pasta. How do you get by? Pasta. All right, pasta. All right, all right. All right. <laughs> so no, it's like you're eating like ox and moose and things like that. Oh, really? Well, you. I know I didn't. I had like nice like lean chicken or whatever. But the point is, is that I, I tried to be this doing this very healthy thing or this thing that's supposed to like. You know, give you an extra six months or whatever. Right, right. Because I'm just trying, wherever I can get it. I was trying right, to floss, get an timeline. extra six months, mm -hmm. so I've been flossing every day. So now I'm up to whatever, you know, What if you floss with meat? If you floss with meat, you live to be about 97. Yeah. Yeah. But is it, but is it worth it? For, no, because by the time you're in, by the time you're 80, 85, I would No, 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 Matt, no, you're in CBS. You're hitting the demographic right between <laughs> the eyes right now. Right. By the time you're 85, you're enjoying... In your prime. NYC. In your prime. You're, you're enjoying... What camera am I on? You're, by the time you're 85, you're enjoying NYC. 2-2, two, two, Sunday night. 10 p.m. <laughs> we'll be right back after some more messages like this. So yeah, you decided. Uh, welcome back, everybody. Uh, you uh, you decided to go with the no beard on this show, then? I didn't have a choice. I was a rookie cop. I mean, I tried, but they wouldn't. Uh, they wouldn't I'm gonna no. I, I think I worked a stash into the second year if it gets if it gets picked up. Right. Because uh, that's that's like as that's as hairless as I've been in many many years. I can't even look. You tell, I can't you tell look me. At that clip, you tell me, man. Magnum couldn't solve crimes. Uh, he, no, he I know. Yeah, but it's when you're a beat cop. Apparently, you can't have. You can have a stash, but it has to go to right here. It can't go lower than here. All right. And I think that. You know, for for the first year, they you know they want to have me on fresh-faced yeah, 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 yeah. and and whatever. But really, it's just hideous. I can't look at that clip. Uh, I mean, the hair is too short. Stop selling this show. The hair is too short. The hair is too short. You look makes my head look even smaller. Um, Your head is the average size. I think I have a small oblong head. No, no, you got an average size head. A lot of people talk about that when they say, I know, they say, hey, yeah, I saw you had Goldberg. I, right, right. Average, average size head. head. Yeah, average yeah. head. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 You, you're I famous get, for it. I get that a lot. Yeah, like, yeah. Hey, people, you're the guy. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Yeah, you're on, yeah, yeah, yeah. Average head. Average yeah, yeah, yeah. head. Average yeah, yeah. head. Yeah, yeah. Oh, I remember seeing yeah, yeah. Private Ryan. You right. were the guy with the average, average head. Average head. Yeah. Yeah. Comes off. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Head totally average. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Well, we're out of time. Look, the girls are laughing. They were really giving me a dirty look when I was being a, a tad, I suppose, lascivious. Well, now they've seen you without a beard, they've realized there's <laughs> possibilities. Right. <laughs> wow. Um, anyway, so um, how you, how you been? 
I'm good, man. I just said we were out of time, but you oh, ignored yeah. me. Oh, really? I, I was just kind of get. I was really getting into my groove. I was starting to get a little comfortable. You know, yeah, I, that, that, I noticed that, and that's why I <laughs> that said. Right, 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 yeah, yeah. No. Adam, everybody, Adam Goldberg, everybody will be right back with Robbie Montgomery. <laughs> you know, you might want to stop putting that Crikey. on the camera. I don't read it, and it just annoys the guests. Yeah. <laughs> don't put that Crikey. on the don't camera. Crikey. On the camera. Well, it's annoying, man. It's, it's offensive to the guests. It's offensive to the guests. It pisses yank. Craig off. Yeah, it pisses me off. You know, the audience is uncomfortable. Well, they, to be fair, they were uncomfortable on their way in. Yeah. Right. Uh, <laughs> right. No. Um, uh, yeah, I only got a dollar fifty from last time. I was looking forward to this. Big cash price. Yeah, I've spent. What time is it, Shadow Stevens? It's time for the big cash prize. All right. All right. Points. Fifty dollars in quarters in a bag with a dollar I sign gotta on. I got tell you, yeah. As an Angelino, very convenient. Very convenient. Right. Put it in the cup holder. Right. You'll never get a parking ticket <laughs> That's again. Right. right. All right. I like okay, it. Okay. You ready? All right. Hold on. All right. There's two ways to win. Yeah. You can either answer a question. Right. Which I have over here. Uh, is it a trivia question? Uh, hold on. There's okay. Way. Uh, or it could be trivia. It could be history. It could uh -huh. be science. It could be sexual. Can it be about me? I'm not good with. Yeah. It might be yet. about you. Okay. Uh, actually, this first one is. Uh -huh. Or you can guess what's in my box. Here's how that works. I imagine right. a box in my head. I don't know what's in it. Only Jeff knows what's in it. You guess what's in it. If you're right, Jeff will tell us. And if you're wrong, something really bad happens to you. Uh, what, would you prefer? what would you guys prefer? Jeff? <laughs> Was that gas? Yeah, yeah, he's got terrible gas. So, so he, is, he is that gas that gets so bad. It comes like out of his cat. mouth. <laughs> it sounds like a cat. Yeah. Yeah. Oh my God. yeah, you ever had that? Oh, it's yeah, bad. actually, yeah. as a matter of fact. All right, so I'll give Paleo you a question diet. then. Okay, all right, all right. All right. All right, uh, Iceland is in the North Atlantic. Oh, it's God, I can't, I can't. Wait, don't, you don't, don't even let me guess what's in the, the box. Let me guess what's in the box. What's in the box? <laughs> All right. Reykjavik. Wait. <laughs> I'm imagining a box in my head. I don't know what's in it. Jeff knows what's in it. Okay. Adam, what's in my box? I got it. A lesbian paleontologist. <laughs> <laughs> Jeff? We would have also accepted a T-Rex umlaut. <laughs> but that is the correct answer. <laughs> My first guest tonight is an actor, writer, musician. He's super talented. He's a bit of a show-off, actually, to be honest. <laughs> He's a musician, an actor, a writer. Oh, he's so great. <laughs> Jerk. <laughs> he's not, he's awesome. Please welcome uh, the, uh, Adam Goldberg, everybody. Adam Goldberg. You're a musician, an actor, uh, a photographer. Right. Okay. Um, uh, actor, uh, I've made a couple of movies. Yeah, I made some movies. Right? This is real. Look at this. Well, oh yeah, you haven't been here. No, so this, this is, is like a, a real show. It's I know it is. <laughs> we got, got we got it all. You got a fire. Fire blazing in the grate oh, there. Oh, yeah, oh, keeping it warm. Warm. You got springy chairs. Springy chairs. Got a yeah. got a rhino. It's like a. <laughs> Oh, you do have a rhino? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It Jeff? was talking last night. Jeff but it was, is good. I think everybody thought. Right yeah, Jeff's here. Yeah. Yeah. Sort of old news, Jeff. Hey, Adam. <laughs> That's Dude, nice. you're an actor, a writer, a director, a producer. A th what the hell, man? Well, I know. I, 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 no, no. I, ma I mainly, I mainly come here. This is actually my sole source of, of income these days. <laughs> I think the last time I was here was to promote a, 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 a television show on this network. In fact, I really? Didn't, what yeah, was it? I'm not sure. <laughs> I can't, uh, did I can't you replace remember. I was a, uh, was a Charlie like Sheen in the uh, yes, Two and a Half right. Men? Didn't yeah, you do that I did. For a while? I did a little. I did a little Charlie Sheen yeah. in Two and a Half Men. For and then a while. The, oh, you did that cop show. What was it called? Um, cops. Sure. <laughs> Gonna need a little help, Jeff. Yeah, I'm not helping you. Uh, okay. <laughs> Sassy on the new stage. Well, the new you stage kind of you upset little him a little I did, bit. I did. A little bit. You were Jeff, a little you're not old news. You yeah, look great. This, yeah. You know what's yeah. old news? The beard's old news. Wow. <laughs> hey, hey. Hey. Come on, the guy apologized. Come right. on. Oh, right. I can sing. I'm an actor. I can grow facial hair. Screw you. 
Let me tell you something. Let me tell you something, Jeff. I could not grow facial hair until I was like 27 years old. So once I could, you know, I was never going to shave. You have to understand. I'm a very late bloomer, you know? At least I bloomed, you know? Jeff, well, Jeff can't grow hair. He doesn't have follicles. Hold on a second. This is between, this is between me and Jeff. No, no, guy, come on. Come on, don't do that. Don't at, least be I, nice. at least I'm a human. Hey, 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 hey. I'm Take a chill pill, I'm, actor, I'm, director, photographer, writer. <laughs> I'm sorry. I've, I've been a little tense ever since. Why are you so I, tense? What's going on? Ever since the new stage thing. Are you get? Are you? You not getting laid? You're not getting laid, right? You need to get laid. <laughs> are you not having sex? What's going on? No, no. I'm having. I'm having plenty of sex. You're not having any sex. I can tell. I'm having plenty of sex with people who aren't directly related to me. <laughs> it's fine. It's totally fine. It's completely fine. Um, what's good? Are you, is there some kind of sexual problem going on? I feel like I, I feel like I touched a raw nerve there. I, I well, like you it, know what it is? Well, it's, it's a raw nerve. Oh, really? Yeah, it's the sexual problem. Do you have a raw nerve I have a raw, I have a raw nerve, yeah. <laughs> on my peepee. <laughs> I have a, uh, it's funny because, you know, in the, in the pre-interview, I, I said specifically not to bring up the, uh, the raw nerve. Can I ask I you guess. something? Can, can I ask you, you, you something? piss a robot off, next thing you know, you're talking about your... Uh... I don't know that it's raw so much, it's chafed. What's a pre-interview? <laughs> yeah, I know. I know. Yeah. You know I use that I term don't do very loosely. Right I, I know, I know, I know. Whatever you said to them, that ain't happening! No, yeah. no that, that's, that was just, oh yeah, that's yeah. just like an extra half hour of, It's just, they like to call, like, they, they like, like to do, it's a no, union thing, but I, know, I don't I want anything to do with it. No, it was, like, like, it was like dinner, you're gonna come tomorrow, you're gonna get in the car, yes, okay, goodbye. Right. Um, yeah, no, yeah. there was no pre-interview. But I did, I did specifically mention, please don't mention any raw nerves. Well, I was, I thought it was... I'd moved on. Beneath the okay, let's I'd moved on. I don't want to. I don't want to talk about your uh, about your sex. I gotta problem. tell you, I'm a little between. I got this over here. Yeah. You know, Jeff is not thrilled with me, and then I got this over there. Yeah, 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 you know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Just kind of like, sort of leering. Yeah. Kind of blousy. Blousy. A little bit blousy. Really? You got any blousy music for secretary? Kind of a drunk. Kind music? of a drunk horse. No, I think that's that's. That's a little bluesy. That, that's, that's bluesy. A little bluesy? Yeah, I, I, I thought it was bluesy. a little more uh, serial killer. -y. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. No, blousy, blousy is going to be a little more honky tonk. You got to let blow that. That's a little more honky tonk. A little more. What the hell happened to you, man? <laughs> Lots of time off, Craig. Yeah, yeah. Lots of time What's off. Going on? What are you doing? I mean, I, I, I follow you on the Tweety. You're taking photographs all the I've time. I've been doing a lot of lot of photography, and I and I write, and then and then and because the computer. Is, is both a, a receptacle for photographic work as well as a writing implement, I, I, I don't leave really the... the, the uh, I've, left, I've left my room since I saw you last four months ago when I was <laughs> promoting that show. Um, that, that, that didn't go? NYC 22. NYC 22. That, I, and that was, uh, how many episodes of that? Did uh, we get? did... Um, Jeff? Little. Yeah, I think it was one. <laughs> I did a show like that once. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, my, my, record, my record is two on air and canceled. Did you, there was a great show that CBS had a couple of years ago. They wouldn't like me for bringing it up, but, I, but they don't like me anyway, right? Okay. So Between there was us. a show called yeah. Viva Lachlan. Did you ever see that show? Seriously? Oh, man. It was sensational. It was like La La Laughlin, Laughlin, Nevada, right? And right. Because like <laughs> Viva La you know. Yeah, but right. it, it was like Viva Las Vegas, but it said but it was Viva Lachlan. Lachlan yeah. And it was a musical drama. No, this is not true. No, no, I'm telling you, it's a true story. <laughs> And it was the executive producer was Hugh Jackman. <laughs> and they would say things like, like yeah. when guys were walking into casinos, they were like, one thing or another. Or, uh, <laughs> it, was, it was unbelievable. Man. Unbelievable. But it sounds kind of maybe also brilliant. Like, it, well, like, I, like loved it. I loved it. I loved it. Keep this on. Please keep it on. Keep it on. Unfortunately, Craig, you're the only person who liked right. it. Right. Uh, it was probably good for the monologue, I too. Loved, Did you use it in your. I loved it. Yeah. Do you like musicals? I do like musicals. Yeah. I mean, I, I, I mean, I don't know how I feel about. I mean, I don't know. Remember that show? There was that show, Cop Rock, many, many right, years ago. Right. It was kind of like that. Yeah, right. Yeah. So I, I don't know if in 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 a in like the sort of serialized uh, procedural context it works that well. You know, I think like, CSI. I have an affidavit. Yeah, yeah, you know that's what I mean? good though. I think... I'm serving you with papers, papers. Yeah, that's good. 
They, see, that's how they reinvigorate the CSI franchise. You know, CSI right. Glee. That's you're, what they need right. to do. Right. CSI you know Glee. That's a yeah, idea. that'd be great. I, I found some sperm. DNA, on the DNA, DNA, DNA. I need yeah. some DNA, DNA. Yeah. 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 Take a break. Yeah. We have to take a break. We'll be right back with Adam Goldberg. <laughs> You think I'm gonna get in trouble for, for giving my old show? Um, no, 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 no. I'll go back every day. I just talk to this dude. I so, because uh, I can't get, in tr I mean, because it's already, I'm, I can't get in trouble at work. Yeah, you, well, you think you're gonna get in trouble because you, you didn't bad what? mouth the show? You no, no, said, the show is great. And right. The, and plus, it's not as though I'm going back to work tomorrow and they're gonna be like, why'd you? Well, the show is cancelled. Right, it's you gone. Said, I can't, is, right, I can't get You're in not trouble. doing it anymore. So. I can't get fired. I could just never not work on CBS again, right? <laughs> You know, you gotta. That, Which, that in a way, be a double-edged sword. Well, I was you gonna know? say, I mean, doing that show was sort of like not working on CBS. <laughs> you can cut that part. Well, right? listen, Jeff and I work on CBS right here. Right, and, you know, and you're constantly well, trying it and badmouth it, right? Yeah, yeah. We, I mean, the thing is about CBS. Th this is the great thing about the the, the CBS Corporation. They can take a joke. Right. Also, they don't know we're here. <laughs> <laughs> right. But. Uh, that doesn't bode well for our pitch, though, because I think we CSI Glee? CSI I think Glee. it's going to be great. Which CSI camera? Glee is, is going to be great. Which camera's on? Please allow me to introduce myself. I'm a detective! I need a DNA sample from you, my brother. <laughs> okay! I, I, I don't know why I went into, like, Porgy and Bess. I don't know. Yeah. That's all right. That's a whole Who other story. Will <laughs> well, I will, my dear, I will can. I will can? <laughs> horses, you can worry the horse is really, really, yeah, really yeah. disturbing. I mean, can you guys, can anybody? Yeah, people can see the can horses. You, can we get a, you know, that's can we, the thing. It's, can we get a cutaway, or is it just going to be yeah, a lot a of me away. talking about Okay. All right, I, there's yeah. a cutaway. We'll put some different music on okay. there. Different music. <laughs> Now, see, that's the music you want as the title music for CSI Glee. Totally. I think that's, the, I think that's your man, too. Or no, gal. No, that, that, yeah. no, that, I think, spoiler alert, but yeah. that could be the killer in the first episode. <laughs> yeah. I think right. this was an inside job. And inside they, a horse. That it? Inside a, right. Inside a Horse, maybe, is the name of the pilot episode. Right. Okay. Inside a Horse, also the name of... Uh... Don't. <laughs> Don't. This is CBS. Porno that I. Oh, why? Um, listen, uh, we're out of time, so oh, you want an right. apple? What do I get? An apple. What, what happened to the bag of change? <laughs> sometimes you get the bag of change, sometimes you get the apple. The horse gets an apple. There's like horse? sugar cubes and, and an apple clearly for the horse, and then there's a bag of change for the humans. You want the apple? I'll take an apple, I guess. Okay. <laughs> Which one do you want? There's two. Think carefully. <laughs> this is a very important decision. Can I, uh... Can I touch or smell them? Yeah, you can touch either one. But if you touch it, that's the one you choose. Okay. You can have that apple. Go ahead. Eat up. I, I, I honestly, I can't do that. Oh, come on now. I... I, I, I honestly have to... It's juicy. I'm sure it's fine. <laughs> I need, to, I need to rinse it, and I, I, need, I also need to know where, where it was purchased. <laughs> That's what I thought. <laughs> I'm going back. Everybody, 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 everybody. <laughs> welcome back, everybody. Welcome back. My first guest tonight is... Oh, you're welcome. Uh, he's a fantastic actor. He's a talented musician with his band, the Goldberg Sisters. They're called that, but they're guys. <laughs> The album Strangers Morning is available now. Please welcome my friend Adam Goldberg, everybody. Adam Goldberg. Is this your first time in the new studio? You I, look like I, 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 probably not, but it feels that No, I'm that pretty sure you've I, been here. I have, uh, you know, I have short-term memory issues. 
Craig. <laughs> Ferguson. Kilborn. I was okay. Craig Kilborn. Yeah. Yeah. Right. yeah. I love. Did you ever do a Kilborn show? I did do. I uh, did it a Kilburn. few times as well. He was yeah. very nice. He was a nice guy. Yeah. Yeah. Very yeah. blonde. But yeah, he had uh, sort of ginger eyelashes, as he I did remember. Have yeah, eyelashes, <laughs> which was actually my stage name for a while. Ginger eyelashes. Mm -hmm. That's right. Mm. Gentlemen, please welcome. Yeah. I like your jacket. You're looking very Downton Abbey. <laughs> <laughs> it is, it's that's, a little bit. That's what I've been going for. Yeah. yeah. I've been going for a Downton Abbey thing. You are a little more put together, if you don't mind Listen, me so. Listen, I decided that today was a very special day, um, and that I was going to wear uh, a jacket rather than just an untucked shirt and, uh, and sneakers, because... What, did you have to go to the bank or something? Uh... <laughs> Yeah, no, I had to make a, I had to go to the ATM, and you know, you I'm, dress up for the ATM. I dress up for the ATM. Yeah, people don't go to you're, banks. You're, you're 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 kind of groomed as well. Usually, well, you're I, I this is never a good idea, but I actually got my beard trimmed, and that's not a euphemism, um, <laughs> and it has nothing to do with my stage name. Um, Downstairs. Well, uh, that that I don't have trimmed. That I, I I, I wax. <laughs> I, uh, yeah. You no, I'm must be insane. You can't uh, wax. Oh, does that. this look? Does anything look waxed here? Look oh. At this. Not, not, come on. Music. Music. That, that music is intoxicating. It's amazing, it's isn't really it? really intoxicating. <coughs> it's funny, it started and I was like, I don't care what it is. I just want to hear more of it. Oh, I want that, are, you we wearing a, that are you wearing a gun? <laughs> <laughs> is, that, is that a gun? Listen, man, it's L.A., man. It's L.A., man. Um, is that no, a gun? That's a phone. It's a phone. You I, have a phone in a holster? I got a phone. Uh, I, can, is it all right if I mock you? <laughs> Look, I set myself up for this. Well, I mean, I, I'm going to have to. It's just you very can, quickly. It'll be over okay, quickly. All right, ready? Go, go, go. Yeah, but, yeah, but, all right, that's fine. <laughs> what is it? He's mocking you, he's mocking you, man. Oh, because you can... Yeah. yeah. Right. What about these guys, opposable, no? Just come over here and I'll show you. <laughs> I like his style. Yeah, that's the way he is. No, you mock right, me, man. but check this out, check this out. Check all right. Out. Right, oh, oh. Yellow. <laughs> Try that with just uh, no holster. It's a tough All crowd, right, but you know what? Ready? I love these guys. You ready? Yeah. Hello? Oh. This is my new thing. I'm trying yeah. to make it happen. I know. I like it. Yeah. I like it's my it. new thing. I'm going to try. I'm try Everyone should be doing it uh, pretty soon. The kids will all be doing it. I, this is like twerking. They're going to go crazy for it. It's the, I think it's the, the, the word. It makes me uncomfortable. I have problems, I think, talking about SEX, I think is what it is. Let's do some therapy then. Okay. All right. <coughs> I'll be your therapist. Can I lie down? or? Uh, yeah, if, if you like. Uh, is that possible? Um, well, it'll be uncomfortable. Um, <laughs> put your feet up. You put your feet up. Well, this is, I guess, the, this is oh, a yeah, fashion yeah, way, right? Yeah, yeah, all right. Um. <laughs> all right. Pants off or on? Um, <laughs> let's leave them on until the commercial break. Okay. Uh, okay. Uh, German accent, a Viennese or Dracula? German, it taps into my self-loathing. Uh, oh, okay. <laughs> so, uh, tell me, sis, how long have you had a problem talking about may I say the word or do I have to spell it? I'd prefer it if you could just um, sp um, spell it. Okay. How long have you had a problem with C-U-N-N-I-N-G? <laughs> I'm afraid, I'm afraid, I'm afraid I can't spell it correctly, so let's just say, I spelled cunning. You see the, uh, it's, it's so close though, it's just so, so you're rubbing so, your neck, is this some, is this a defense mechanism? It's, I just, um, I can't move my, I can't move my hand now, um, so I could be, here, here, uh, take a drink of this. Mother? Yes. Mother? Take a drink of this. Thank you, Mother. Penis replacement cup. Thank you, Mother. Is... Thank... F f thank you, Mother. <laughs> this is it's funny because it's an edible, it's an edible joke. No, no, wait, 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 wait. wait. Okay. They're, we'll they're scared and okay. so am I. Okay. <laughs> oh, okay. Okay. You're acting too much. Mm. What the hell is that? Mm. It's carbonated. Mm. That's you, really just. That's you upsetting. don't like carbonated. Well, no, beer? it's just weird because I think it was taking. A, I think that was a. Uh, I mean, it was a cost-benefit analysis I had to make there. You know, do I go along with that and take a sip of God knows what you? 
Well, you know there. me. You know that it's going to. It's not going to be anything weird. Well, I don't know what. I mean, you know, you've probably if you've maybe fallen off the. Old Listen, if I fall off the wagon, right, it's right. not going to be me sitting here doing lame jokes. <laughs> right, right, right. First of all, yeah. he's going to be in hospital. Yeah, right. <laughs> and you know, and I'm going to be on the local news. I it's going it. to be okay, a very right. different thing. No, no. I guess I wasn't. I wasn't expecting carbonation. So no. I thought maybe something had turned. I don't know that water turns when it when it this falls. Is, this all came from the fact that I said your hair was looking neat. Oh right. So anyway, so I yeah I got a I I got well the hair has been actually growing. Well, out we for don't weeks. have any time now. Ah, well, it's a commercial break. I, we I we wanna, can talk about it when I we come back. I just wanted to talk about my hair, man. So when I want to talk about I'm your here. album? No, I want to talk about my hair. <laughs> all right, we can. Uh, Sorry. Put the commercials on later. Sorry. All right. <laughs> Talk about your hair then, let's hear about it. I don't know, I just am ambivalent about it, you know? Really? It yeah. doesn't sound like it. Well, I just feel like... We'll be right back after these messages. Are... A track off of uh, uh, the Goldberg Sisters album uh, Strangers Morning. Correct. Which is available on the uh, internet. You can get which it Which is on, on limited time. Did, what's that? The internet? The, uh, yeah, it's going to be shut down. It's going to be done. It's going to be Yeah, it's going away. It's a Time Warner deal. Forget about it. <laughs> can I say that? I don't know. Can we talk about Time Warner now? Uh, that, are we friends with them again? Is that. Did that resolve? <laughs> did, did, did that resolve? I don't know. Are, are we, is this being seen? I don't care. Yeah, right. uh, <laughs> but listen, you, you told me in the commercial when I was listening to the music, yeah. you said that there's the Goldberg Sisters is just. It's all you now. Well, this record, I played everything myself. You didn't have any other musicians? You just did it all? No, I had a guy named Andrew Lynch, who's, Lynch, who's a brilliant uh, engineer and musician, but he just recorded me, and I played everything for two months and by, in my garage, and by the end, went a little Jack Torrance all over yeah, the time. I, I and I hacked Andrew to death, but, um, but I have a great album to show for it. That's ah, always funny, isn't it? <laughs> I've never seen an audience so scared. <laughs> Yeah, they're, they're kind of like, I, we don't know if I'm right. getting. Yeah, and the I thing know. is, he's not. Right. <laughs> is, he, well, is he nodding or is he doing horse? something personal with him with himself? <laughs> he's just trying to make you feel good. Yeah, man. I appreciate yeah, he, he likes you too. Yeah, he does? He likes you. Everybody likes you. It looks like now he you likes me a little too much. Look what's going on in there. <laughs> yeah, I... That, didn't you get the memo from the network where they give you the thing where you can't with the guests? I'm Goldberg, everybody! <laughs> Weird, so that was really weird, man. I was, I was like a weird show. I mean, like you know, uh, Adam is weird, and that 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 beard thing, like beardy weirdy. <laughs> the hell was his deal, man? I don't know, man. He's gone Hollywood. <laughs> Do you notice that he wore a denim shirt and jeans? It's an odd hell, choice. Man. It's an odd choice. You know, it's it's kind of like you know we call that doing a Leno where I'm from. <laughs> <laughs> Don't applaud that, Denmarkians. You don't know what the hell I'm talking about. So, uh, we're uh, wave goodnight, Jeff. 